cool, cool, cool. Wait, wait, hang on. Oh no, there's no audio coming in from Discord. Not, not this again. Say something. No, it's not working. Do I have to like <clears throat> create new Discord source every stream? Edit my reactive PNG. Okay. Well, I have this code coming in for that one, and then we just switch over to this one, and then. Uh, can someone say something? Uh, hello. hello. Oh yes, it Ooh. works. Wow. Okay. okay. And let me yeah. just check I the can ending. Hear it on stream. Okay, great. Good. 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 Excellent. You should change back to your. <laughs> <laughs> DM, DM no. PNG. No. <laughs> oh. It's it's delicious. Everyone should try it. It tastes Which like one? fruity pebbles. Fruity pebbles is a great machine. What are we talking about? Happy what birthday, is the flavor, actually? Uh, fruity pebbles. It's it it's it's basically artificial fruit flavoring. Oh. Oh, huh. that kind of disappointed me. I was hoping it was ube. <laughs> oh, ube? Yeah. Why? It's purple. It's gonna be like halo halo. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, it could also be just like blueberries and stuff. That's true. Oh, true. Blueberry and ice cream would make purple. Mm hmm. Hmm. But yeah, from from like the description that that people have of its actual flavor is that it it tastes like it tastes like fruity. Ah! <laughs> oh. <clears throat> it's not it's not as fun when 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 the when Discord picks up the random noises and, and animates the uh, the movement. Ah uh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> yes. True. Okay. Uh, I guess this means that we're starting without I think Silver so. Star. Yeah, she's okay. Mm. I don't know how long she will yeah. be suffering. Unless she can role play on, you know, the ceramic <laughs> throne. <laughs> ceramic throne. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, yes. So, uh, where is... Oh, no, it's frozen. There no. we go. Oh, did I not? Wait. Ah. Oh, wait. You can still see through the wall. The windows are still doors. <laughs> yes, <laughs> I think that's intentional. <laughs> wait, hang on, hang on. Let me, let me just I... move stuff to wherever people are. Okay. Yes, yes. Oh my gosh. What's happening? Oh no, no. The door is in the way. Um, you can still see through the windows, but you can't see through all the windows, right? Yeah. You you can only see through some of the windows. Yep. Yep. Just that, uh, just that stuff is is gray, grayish, because mm -hmm. you know what? I'm just gonna reset everyone's vision. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, that would be for the best. There we go. There we go. I can't see through the walls anymore. I can't see the past. <laughs> we can't. Oh yeah, we don't know how we got here. The whole garden is gone. Yep. Memory wipe. 
Okay. What is our recap? Uh, shoot, I don't remember either. Um. Uh. Hmm. Uh, y'all, y'all ditched um Enderlin's weird, creepy performance in Who oh, yes. Crane's here. <laughs> Um, at which point, uh, your good friend Molliver was like, uh, I didn't sign up for this suicide mission. Okay, bye! <laughs> I'm surprised but, he just ditched his friends. Aren't they here? <laughs> but his friends are also in, in Yawn. And true. Gotta, gotta get back to them, let them know that they might need to prepare your funeral. I mean, what? Bruh. <laughs> what? What? Does he really think we're gonna die? No, no, he doesn't. Is this how we're gonna finish the campaign through TPK? <laughs> I mean, yes. also possible, I suppose. No. Just rocks fall, everyone dies. <laughs> um, and then, and then what else? Uh, you guys got here. You met some uh, awakened animals that were talking about how wonderful and charitable the hags were. Uh, and then, yep. and then Hesedil and Camille made their way here also. Mm -hmm. Uh, after, uh, I, I think <clears throat> they dashed while following you guys in the airship. Yes, the they did. Yeah, so, so they were, they were just dead for a bit. <laughs> uh, and then you guys found a crown of thorns, oh wait, a crown of something. Yes, the golden crown thing yeah uh, it was a silver crown and then when you placed it onto uh onto wrath yes onto wrath it became a golden crown yes and and uh supposedly some of the doors are unlocked now oh i forgot which one nice. those are uh i think wrath is the hard one Yes. No, wait. wait. Wrath is... I'm so confused. <laughs> <laughs> Who, Wrath and Envy. Yes. Envy was... What were they? They're the, the lion? Iron lion, yes. Yeah. I oh, yes. what then... symbol their doors unlocked. I'm pretty sure it's a lion. That's it. But Kismet... Something that surprised me is you said heart instead of, um, what's that? Reindeer. Oh, because it's written here. Yeah. Oh. Well, On the... Oh. Hmm. I, have I know you mentioned they were a heart. For the lion. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, it's written I forgot where? what it was said. Oh. In my notes. In her notes. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Let's see. And we also made Elliot's crab sentient and chocolate. Oh, yeah. Food. Yes. <laughs> ah, yes. It just wants to stab now, everything. Yes. What's the worst that yeah. could happen? I feel like this <laughs> is a bad idea. No. <laughs> I don't think crabby. so. Yes. Maybe next time you can put all of your fish in from your bag of colding into the uh, oh, fountain no. so Are that they, they can all talk. I and then when we are hungry, they... we fish them back out. <laughs> yeah. No! Oh no! Yes. <laughs> wow, chaotic evil group. <laughs> <laughs> well, we haven't planned on killing Zibilna, so... We're not that e evil. I think. Why would we kill Zibilna? That's... Anako's patron, right? Exactly. No. But then if you take over as the Archfey, you could be Endico's new patron. I don't want to do oh. that. <laughs> <laughs> that would be very awkward. Thank you. <laughs> no, but then you I can mean, be like, what? we can be friends forever now. No. <laughs> <laughs> you can be Endico's new friends mom. in high places. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> What could okay. be worse than working? Uh, what what could be better than working for your friend? <laughs> 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 mm. 
Uh, what else happened? Oh, we met Thinnings? Yes. Yes, yes dude. Hello. Yes, he's the... What is he? <laughs> I don't know what he is. Um, He is... A servant. Thing. He's a butler. Oh. Black butler. Oh, I don't have any notes until after that. Yeah, because mm, yeah, we because... ended in this room. Yes. While well, Hesediel and Camille were trying to spook Thinnings, that's where we <laughs> ended. <laughs> Did I show you guys a picture of Thinning? I don't think so. Okay. Uh, let me just scroll down. Oh. Oh. Oh, that's how he was hiding. Change for the obvious. Bigger than I expected. <laughs> Why? I mean, because you. It's only obvious because of the glowing eyes. Like oh, otherwise, yeah. if like he scuttles in a little bit more, I'd probably miss it. <laughs> I think it's also the angle because he was ex. The the book writes it that he he expects. <laughs> the book writes it with the expectation that you would enter through this door. Oh. Oh. <laughs> we just went through the wrong door. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> He's like, Don't know uh, how got here. <laughs> <laughs> it's unlocked, so like, we're fine. That's true. Right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yes. So, um, and we decided to have a long rest, I think. And he told us to unfreeze his goblin friends, I, if, if I can. remember correctly. Oh, right. Okay. Yes. Um. <clears throat> goblin friends whose names I totally have. Yes. Bob. They're all just named Bob. Hi, Bob. Uh, oh, Bob. Yes, one, one, one is Boblin the Goblin, one is uh, yes. <laughs> Bobble the Goblin. Uh, Oops. <laughs> uh, but yes, um, you guys, which unicorn do you, which unicorn horn do you take out to unfreeze them? Oh, God. Hmm. Which unicorn? We don't know which we have because you guys got some in Endelin. No, not Endelin's. Um, in Scabatha's house, and I don't know which one she got from you guys. I have a list, but it's probably like wrong because I'm confused. <laughs> yeah, we were trying to figure out where is which, but we don't know anymore yeah. after Scabatha took it. She took, I think, Elliot's one, which is from the circus, the witchlight place, and then yeah, she the merry-go-round. Took... Yeah, yeah. There was also the Andacosis one, which is from the cauldron, I think. From the the coal thing. Yeah, and then we have the rest. The rest is with us. The, the rest, rest of us. <laughs> I don't remember which is which. Uh, but... based on this list that I have, trauma horse. We have one from the coal fire, the darkling store, trauma horse, aka the carousel, and the a unicorn horse. costume. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and then we also have one other one from Skabatha's uh house, the one that Andakos got from a crate, I think. I don't know if that's the one she stole or it's an entirely new one. So but gonna... we have that. I have a hoard in my inventory, in but... Mark. Yeah, I think that's the one. <laughs> yeah. So we'll use that one, the newly acquired one. Oh, uh, okay. Uh... Assuming it's the trauma horse one. Why is that... Wait, 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 hang on. Trauma... Uh... Wait, which... Which, which we don't... Oh, uh, hmm? cupboards in Lumlech. Okay, got it. Yes. Uh, so, uh, you say Bob's name and you tap on him. Uh, can you roll me a d20? Oh. Uh... Eight. Eight. Uh... 
Uh, <clears throat> so you 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 say his name. You tap him with the with the, um, with the horn, and you feel a flow of magic. But then it starts to twist and and turn around you. Plants grow around you, and you are restrained for one minute. Oh, oh. no! <laughs> what is this? Oh happening? no! Is this gonna be like the wild magic thing again? Yes, with the unicorn. I suspect. Well, oh, we I have guess a I'm just. To get cheese again. <laughs> yes. Cheese. Here for one minute. <laughs> I'll just vibe here for one minute. Anyone else want to try a unicorn? I kind of want to try. try. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you yes. go first. I'm gonna help you out with those uh plants. <laughs> Thank you. Three, one, B, twenty. Uh. Uh, one. Okay. Uh, the same Fire horn, horn is it? Uh, is it the same horn? It's Are you gonna use a different same, horn? Same, same horn. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> so, so again, you, 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 you feel like there's some magic surging from from the horn, um, but this time it it oozes and flows around. Um, you it. And then it's it sort of like drips down along the side of the horn, uh, and then drips down onto the ground beneath you. A puddle of grease appears where you are standing with a ten foot radius. You and anyone within ten feet of you must make a dexterity check. Uh, sorry. <laughs> uh, oh god. Based on your spell save DC, or they'll fall. Okay. What's my dexterity? Dexterity saving throw. <laughs> Oh, saving throw, yes. Uh, yeah, dexterity saving throw. Okay. Oh, pain. <laughs> <laughs> Guess I'm falling. Seven. And then, and then the thing's <laughs> like, oh, <laughs> just have to clean this up later. <laughs> oh, oh no, we're leaving a mess for him. Anyone got press the digit thing? Sixteen. <laughs> I don't know. Wait, what's your spell save DC? Andy, Andy oh, spell safe. Yes. Yes. It's like seventeen, bro. Oh, okay, I also <laughs> fall. Oh no! <laughs> I'm oh. entangled in vines so and I also fall down. <laughs> you somehow fall down. <laughs> yeah, you are now restrained and prone. What? What? Uh, what? No. What? Worse could happen. What could go wrong? Okay, Elliot, uh, go. <laughs> maybe I step a little bit away before I do my. You mage hand it. Maybe use your mage hand. <laughs> and I roll 1d20. Uh, yes. yes. Which horn are you using? Oh, right. Uh, the there's one? only one, right? Uh, we, have we have four. <laughs> four, possibly five. <laughs> yes. I'll use the one that you guys were using. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um. So, so this time. Um, you feel it more before before anything else. You feel like uh, you feel the flow of magic from from the the horn, but then nothing much happens afterwards. But you feel a little tingle behind each ear, and then uh... <clears throat> oh fuck! <laughs> um, you you feel a little a little tingle behind each ear, and 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 it kind of sounds like you're more aware of ambient noises around you. Uh, what everyone else sees is um, Elliot has sprouted an additional ear behind each of his oh. original ears. Oh. Oh. That's okay. gross. <laughs> yeah, that's... I think that's scary. Kind of weird. Yeah. I feel like it would be fine if... My hair covers it ears. though, so... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh. But at least you can hear us better. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, <laughs> that is it. <laughs> so, um, so this effect lasts until you have been branded with a hot iron. Oh. Or if it's been I dispelled. Don't. <laughs> well, I'll, I'll have an extra pair of ears for a while. <laughs> for your whole you life, get, you just have an extra pair. Do you get advantage <laughs> in perception rolls now? No. <laughs> oh. What? That's no. not fair. <laughs> <laughs> okay, fine. Roll a roll a meta persuasion check against the DM. Wait, persuasion. Oh. 
<laughs> yeah, like whatever stat your charisma is, just roll persuasion oh, okay. with proficiency. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Okay, I have I have like zero charisma. Oh. Okay, yeah, you know what? Yes. Um the the the, the extra oh, years will I, I uh that, we'll, we'll just say that the extra years give you a, a, a plus plus one d two modifier <laughs> to your perception checks, <laughs> and and also your passive involving, perception involving sight. Yes. So let's see. Involving sight. One d two. I mean, quite obviously, it would be if it's here. Yeah. So yeah, you. Do you want me to update your character sheet for you? Ah, uh, yes, thank you. Okay. Well, okay, since we've all gotten, like, weird effects, are we really gonna be trying to free everyone with this janky horn? <laughs> I mean, janky we haven't horn. tried the others. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I pocket this horn. Oh, Syria. <laughs> Next horn, please. What, yes. what other horns do we have? We have the unicorn we costume have... one. I can give yeah, let's one try one. the one from the unicorn costume. I don't have mage hands, so I will be in danger. You guys can step away That's if okay. you can. <laughs> I can't. Can I I'm get up? Can, can I can I pull pull Sinaris <laughs> as I get up? Do I have to roll for this? Cause I'm still in a puddle, right? <laughs> uh, wait, wait, what's what's the question again? Like, okay, I want to, cause I fell as well. Oh. I want to yeah. get up. And like move to a safe location, but I want to pull pull Sinaris along with me because it's <laughs> bound. So yes. how how good did that turn out? Um, <laughs> give me your dexterity saving throw, I guess. Oh no, actually, uh, give me an acrobatics check, I guess. Yeah. Okay. Oh no. I guess oh. you managed to. Okay. Yay! Nice. Yay! Thank you. <laughs> What's here, yeah? D20. Is it still Are the same horn? Are you guys like away already? It's a different horn. No, no I'm it's using uh... the one from the unicorn costume. Uh, eh? From Will of the Feywilds. Oh, oh, okay. 19. Are 19, 19. Are you guys 19. still this close? Or did you guys move? <laughs> no, we moved. It's just that I, I'm too lazy to move my back. You feel <laughs> you feel magic flow from the wand and it gathers at the tip and then it radiates through the, the goblin. The goblin starts moving and then he just continues dusting and then he goes, Wait. Oh. Oh. Where, where? What? Who are you people? Oh. Uh, oh. Sir, oh, uh, sir, sir, what's sorry, going on? Oh, oh yeah, and, oh, he, right. and, he, and he slips and falls. <laughs> falls prone. <laughs> no. Uh, I will attempt to help him up. <laughs> Let's just draw a little <laughs> a pool of Grease oil. Puzzle. Yes. Hopefully he can clean What's it up. What's the best way to clean up oil? <laughs> With fire. <laughs> no. Is it flammable? <laughs> also. Um, it said grease, so I'm assuming it's the same as the grease spell. Oh no. Let's just put boiling water on it. Produce flame. Let's go. <laughs> no. <laughs> just start the grease fire. Exactly. Oh. Um, Thinnings, can you help us? Uh, Explain the situation to this goblin. Uh, named Bob. Yeah, yeah. He he takes Bob to the side and 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 uh and, and starts explaining a situation where where he talks about like um uh there's been a coup. Uh, Zibona has been overthrown. She's she's trapped somewhere. Everyone's frozen in time. Uh, these people here are seem like they're helping. So perhaps we might actually be able to trust them. Things like that. Okay. Yeah, uh -huh. that's the gist of it. So, um, are we gonna go around trying to unfreeze everyone? To everyone? <laughs> or do we just do this to Zubilna? Or I guess, uh, 
or two Wait, does, whatever. Does the next know if like if we freeze a villain that everyone else will be free? Um who? The thinnings. Um Thinnings? Uh no. As in as in he knows that, that if you freeze Zivona, Zivona would would actually you know what, give let me I'm I'm just gonna give you a and John. uh insight check for him. Oh no. Okay. Insight insight or history, let's see. Insight. Normal. Well. Okay, he 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 knows that that um if you use it on on Zibona, you'll free Zibona. Um, it probably won't uh, it probably won't end the curse that's on everyone. Um, you you might you might need a you might need to 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 um uh. How, how do I how do I phrase this? You'll you'll need to 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 end the curse that's on everyone to free everyone. But Zibona's power might be strong enough for her to eventually, um, break the curse on everyone. Maybe with a wish spell or with a lot of um, uh, anti magic spell. Oh, right. Okay. Oh, by the way, uh, I think we have questions for Thinnings. Oh, since um, we this whole time we've been trying to look for Zibilna and we actually don't know how she looks like, could you help us find out how she looks like so that we'd better um, find her? So we her? know her when we see her. <laughs> yeah, we know her when we, when she, uh, when we see her. Uh, Thinnings narrows his eyes and then, and then looks at Endercoast and then... Oh. Wouldn't your friend there know what she looks like? Oh, wait! You've met Zibilna, like face to face. Do I remember? Hmm. You you could give, you could give me a history check, I guess. I suppose it has been a while, but. But I I. A wisdom saving throw. <laughs> This this isn't an intelligence saving throw check. It's just a, a history check. Oh, like how well do you remember the person giving you giving you powers? Oh, yeah, nice. for sure. How how could you? <laughs> it how could you ever forget that 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 face of this beautiful, um, hey. uh, <laughs> this 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 beautiful I benevolent I woman? Okay. So you tell us how she looks like, and hopefully we know that she... <laughs> hopefully we don't miss her somewhere in the castle. Oh... Do we have, like, a picture? Mm. Um... Yeah, is there a picture of Zibilna somewhere? I do, but, but I'm thinking how do I show it to only... only uh, Endercoat, and then we, we see how you describe her. Oh... Yes. Assuming oh. you describe her well. <laughs> oh man. That, okay, yeah, yeah. I was a little bit worried about that. <laughs> that's why mm. that's why I need a picture, man. Um Yes. Damn it, where is it's not this. And DM me? <laughs> I, I think Oh you could probably, probably use my best. disguise kit. Like to show how she looks like. Yo, you know what? Damn it. That made it so easy right now. I'm gonna do that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just use my disguise kit and then how, make yourself how look well like you're building. Apply it, though. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing. Oh, don't worry. I have a disguise kit myself. We have. Okay. Makeup. Good, good. <laughs> yes. Okay. Slayify uh... yourself. <laughs> <laughs> this, this is so scuffed, but I'm basically gonna take a screenshot of. Yeah. Of a profile. Because <laughs> I don't know where the, the picture I downloaded is. It is so stupid. Hey, where's my oh. snipping? I snipped it. I snipped it. Now. Why is it freezing? 
You know those makeup transformations that trended once? Hmm? Oh yeah. <laughs> it's just Undercoast does that. <laughs> okay, DM'd. Why can't I just use my disguise kit? <laughs> oh, true. <laughs> Uh, yeah. <laughs> Let's okay, send it okay. to everyone. <laughs> Give me yeah. a... Uh, wait, are you proficient with the disguise kit? Uh, I, I yes, I think you are. Yes. Okay, then I give am. me give me your disguise kit uh, proficiency check together with your... Uh, 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 Guidance. Uh, <laughs> let's see. I guess... Performance or dexterity? Performance or dexterity bonus? Oh, okay. Oh. Wait, how do you... Uh, not, not dexterity, sleight of hand. Performance or sleight of hand? Performance or sleight of hand? Yeah. To, oh, okay. To put the makeup and costume on. <laughs> and I suppose to like, um, make, li make fine little changes to, to the clothing they give you. That it matches what you've seen. Oh, okay. Wait, so it's just a performance. Performance roll? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah, a performance or a sleight of hand roll, and you add proficiency if you don't have it. Proficiency. Yeah, just roll first. Oh. Oof. Well, I legit had. Wait, what? Oh my god. <laughs> uh, it's subpar. You feel like it doesn't really do her justice. Oh. Mm. But it's it's decent enough for them to recognize she's like this. Um, you know what? Yeah, I'll 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 count it as a pass. Um. Okay. <laughs> now the question is, how do I show it to everyone again? Uh, just can't... send the screenshot over into which like channel. Yeah. I, I, okay, fine. <laughs> oh, actually, I guess if I were to, to lower down the, the resolution of the screenshot, then you... <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> no. <laughs> Uh, which like general control face is not working. Okay. Oh, oh no. that's why it's not working. Oh, he has long hair. Yeah. Whoa. Damn. Okay. Now that we know swipe. how she looks like, we'll be able to find her better, hopefully. <laughs> I'm gonna help the goblin clean up the grease. Are you gonna unfreeze more goblins? Are we? I feel like it's a hassle. We're gonna be doing <laughs> this all the time. Yeah. So yeah. many roles before unless, we go to. Unless they can fight. Oh, yeah, true. No, the goblins are non combatant. Okay, they're useless. Oh. Let's just leave them. <laughs> <laughs> You wanted an army of goblins before we fight. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um, does anyone else have questions for Thinnings? Oh, right. Um, I wanted to ask Thinnings, I think, last session. Where do we find the aviary thing for the owl? So we can scare away the... What do you call it? Jabberwock? Jabberwock. Um, yes. it's, it's at the far end. Of um, it's at the far corner uh, at the north northeast wing of of this of of this floor. Um, it'll it'll be a bit hard though. Uh, there's quite a bit of danger along the way. Um, oh. But what 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 you want to do is is you want to you want to um go go out of this hallway, um and then <clears throat> and then instinct and then you take the um. 
well the most direct route would be to take the door on the right but there's there's a, a, a fomorian giant in there just eating all the food so you'll need to somehow get past that giant and then you'll enter a like a t-shaped corridor and um it's 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 to the right of of the like like a um like a the long narrow part of the corridor near near the windows oh okay um be extra careful know. because um the uh it it, it um it attacks everyone who who isn't Zivilna, including me. Oh. Oh. Oh, but you can speak to animals, Elsiria. You can probably calm it down and uh, tell it what we need. You mean and it might want the, the uh, Jabberwock owl? snack. Yeah, the owl, the giant owl. That owl. Hmm, maybe. Well, hopefully. Oh. Uh, Oh, is, are there any, like, traps we should be wary of? Um... I suppose as, as part of the castle, no. But, but, um, you, you'll want to be wary of, of, I suppose, any intruders or invaders that, that are here. Oh, I see, I see. <laughs> well, thank you for the information. Um, we'll be sure to help out here whenever we can. Um, does anyone else want to do anything? Or do we go? Do we set off? Are you still bombed? Oh no, I'm helping the goblin clean up the floors. <laughs> You're just rolling in it. <laughs> <laughs> I got the mop from the closet or something, I don't know. I... <laughs> Oh yeah, uh, you notice that, that there's a mop in the closet, but there's no broom. Oh, the top. <laughs> that's so weird. Okay. And and the goblin is also like, that, the, the broom was there just a minute ago. Oh. <laughs> Wait, where'd the broom go? Why? We're fine. <laughs> I'm sure it's somewhere in the castle. Okay, um, I guess we set off. Okay. Unless you guys have any preparations you have to do, preparing your spells, getting stuff. I forgot my spells. <laughs> we can Drink set off. your drugs. Long rest, right? We had a long rest. Yeah, we we had yeah. a long rest. Okay. Yes. Okay. We will go. Wait, do I remember what the Fomorian is? <laughs> do I know? They're, they're, um, yeah, you know what, give me a history check. Or oh, you could flip through a serious notes. Oh? I don't think I have that. It's <laughs> very, very, very early in the note. What? 17. Uh, you vaguely remember there's, there's, uh, um, this little dragon friend of yours mentioned something about it. The, um, they, they, he, I forgot the dude's name. Uh, so, so uh, something. Talabar. Talabar. Yeah, so Talabar was, was sent by the Summer Queen to uh, ask for Zibilna's alliance and allegiance uh, in the aid against the Fomorians, which is like yes. this this uh, race this race of giants that are uh, brutish and just want to they they just love chaos and destruction. Ah. Uh. So I assume we can't really... The only thing hmm. in my notes says enemy giant. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Very vague. <laughs> I do remember Oberon, my patron, quote-unquote, uh, was telling me about killing Fomorians, but they might be more trouble than they're worth. Especially since Zibilna's on the way. Okay. Just in uh, case, can I ride your broom? <laughs> oh, sure. I'll be on my broom and not touching the floor in any way. Assuming there's traps. Yeah. I go to the toilet. Um, while you like guys in are... game or? <laughs> 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 like right now. Okay. Like real life. 
Yeah, um, we can take a, so a short break. Um, and, okay. and while you guys are, are going ahead to explore, um, Kamiel is very obsessed with this cabinet uh, because he's noticed that in the lower lowest drawer of the cabinet, there is... Um, it's a gun. Where is it? Um, at the bottom drawer of the, the, the dresser, there there is a lot of rings. It's just a massive collection of rings. And Anthony is, is looking very stressed. Uh, while Hesediel is constantly bonking um, Kamiel for constantly trying to slip a hand in to steal a ring. Oh. <laughs> yeah, Wait, so... Are those Thinnings' collection or something? Yes. yes. Oh. Well. <laughs> Kamiel, don't do that. That's not yours. You're gonna get hanged on the tree again. Hanged. Yes. Oh, what is this? Hmm? There's a ton of people in there. Ah. Yes. Yes. Uh, let me just yoink. We will wait for uh, Shizuo to be back. Okay. Then I'll tell. Okay. Um, question about yeah. like my infusion. Mm -hmm. Uh, if like, I'm not sure. Can you check if it's like counting my um? Infusion into my armor class? Uh, are you wearing it? Wait, let me just find yes. your character. When I wear it, I have disadvantage on Plus... stuff, right? Oh, which armor is this? Uh, the adamantine armor. Oh. The adamantine scale mail. Yes, I think you do. Yeah, that's fine. But just. <laughs> Just wanna make sure the yep, it, defensive fusion. It says mm -hmm. you it's calculating based on equipped armor. So yep. if it's equipped. So it was uh, plus one. Supposedly. Uh wait, where where is the where's the use adamantine scale mail? Yeah. Uh wait, but the use adamantine scale mail isn't an, an infusion. You infused uh, it with something, it's right? Not, like, it's an item I have. Oh, and then you but, give it like infusion. Can a plus I, one like... infusion. Um, yeah. But the plus one infusion only works for non-magical item, and oh, adamantine is a magical item. It it counts as a magical item because when you search for oh. magical items, it's it's a it goes into the list as magic armor. But if you have, I see. If you have a shield, or if you have a normal shield, you can give it the plus one infusion, and then... Oh! And then... Hold the shield. You hold the shield, you put it together with adamantine armor, and then you have a buttload of... of AC. Of AC, yeah. It would... So, so what happens to my class? Like, my like, rogue class? Like, like, if you have... <laughs> if you have... You're not a rogue anymore. <laughs> Yeah, if, if you have um if you have a shield it's plus two, then you put a plus one on it and then your your armor class just becomes nineteen. Ooh. Oh I don't have a shield. Uh, but Syria also being a shield. one brain cell tank. Yes. <laughs> I only have one brain cell. Oh you can uh, what infusions did you get? That one and you, I think you have another one? Defense and then mine sharpener. So for if I have armor, then like if I fail Constitution saving throw, I get to reaction to succeed. Oh, okay. And then radiant weapon. Ooh. Plus one bonus to attack damage. With the infused weapon. Yes, it's yes. Because I already have like the, what are those, sneak attack stuff. So I was like, mm -hmm. that will work. Yeah, that mm. should work. Does anyone else want me to enhance their defense? Nah, I'm good. Oh, before anything, I'm gonna cast Mage Armor. <laughs> 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 I have uh, been needing to do that. Oh no, that means I'm like kind of wasted the uh, one infusion. Oh, maybe, oh yeah. maybe you'll find a use for it somewhere down the road. <laughs> Potentially, I maybe. hope you're not checking me here. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> like, maybe you'll find a shield or something. Just pick it up? Okay. I mean, maybe I'll keep it for now then. 
I'm pretty sure I'm a very we can find one somewhere. Rogue, though. <laughs> oh, I can't, yeah. I can't attack if I have my shield on my hand, right? Um, you still have one other hand to attack with. My dagger. Yeah, like like so you have one hand free for you to use your dagger, right? You have two hands. Yeah. You have a shield in one hand, yeah. and you have your dagger in the other hand. A short sword. Well, that, you have can I use a shield and a short sword? Yeah, you can. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. What's the plus one short sword in my inventory like? From radiant weapon, or is it from something else? I think it's a magical. Is it in? Is it not? Um. Oh, it's a magic weapon, right? It's a yeah. it's a magic weapon, yes, but I can't remember where it came from. Didn't you fish uh, it somewhere? <laughs> mm, no, because like for the radiant weapon infusion, it just says it's a magic weapon with plus one bonus to attack, and that's exactly what the plus one short sword is. Oh, okay. Mm. I I'll just assume it's from here. Maybe. Uh. Maybe maybe. It sparkles whenever you swing it, so. Possibly <laughs> the sus one. Possibly. Um. I mean, it'll match the radiant weapon thing, so I'm just gonna pretend it is. Yeah. Okay. You, you could um, you could add that to the descriptions then. Yeah. Yes. Confusion. Radiant weapon. The only thing I remember about, about the stuff that she fished up is that they were, they are either they will either have the used tag on it or uh, used used in the label or suspicious on it. Oh, and man. and the plus one sword that she she fished up was given to uh Barbitos. Oh right. Oh really? They already had their own sword, sword from Sir Palavar. Uh, but it was a dagger. Oh right. Right, right. Yeah. I remember. Uh, oh, I can make it glow. I can use... You can make one what? ...one charge to blind an attack after being hit. Oh, nice. You just blind all of us. Okay, but I have to roll and see how many charges I have for these things. Mm-hmm. Char expanded charges daily at dawn. Uh, does it have a max amount of yeah. charges available? I'll just roll them now. Okay. Oh, not bad. Now I gotta read up Seven. radiant weapon also. <laughs> oh, yes. I should <laughs> as well. Artificer. I think I think Magic. four charges is the maximum. Yeah, okay. So you have That's four. Fine. Nice. I was half expecting you were gonna get the goggles of night thing when you create a magic item so that you can oh. finally see in the dark. <laughs> you could have <laughs> you could have told me. No, but I think I, you're I think fine, you're fine. Mind shielding. Oh right. Yeah. So I'm immune to magic that allows other creatures to read your thoughts, determine whether you're lying, know your outline, or know your creature type. And mm. they can... Mm. That sounds good. Yep. If I die, my soul goes into the ring. My oh. You just... Wait, how do we get you back? <laughs> uh, I don't think so, but you can talk to me. <laughs> So I'm not lonely. Oh right, yeah, I have the helm yeah. of telepathy. I can talk to you. No, no, you you can just put the ring on and become attuned to it, and then you'll you'll. Oh. 
Wait, yeah. but if I die, would my soul also go into the ring? Um, I don't oh. think so. Let me see. If you die while wearing the ring, your soul enters it unless it already houses a soul. Oh, no. okay. I can't yeah. just have you scooch over and also be in it. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yeah. So, so, so what some people do when when they when they play characters when, when they when they're giving given like a common magic item or it's mm -hmm. common, uh, it uh, is uh, uncommon is that they'll 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 create their character with a tragic backstory. Oh, my brother, my 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 sibling went on an adventure and they had this ring of mind shielding, but they died, and so their soul yeah. is trapped in here. And now I'm I'm wearing their ring of mind shielding to to to. <laughs> To avenge them, mm -hmm. it's 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 somehow it's it's somehow a everyone just has this same brain cell on what to do with a ring of mind shielding for their tragic character backstory. <laughs> I can I mean, just imagine sounds someone like a fun backstory. <laughs> I can imagine like someone down the line of their generation just having ten rings of their ancestors all talking to them Whoa! at once. <laughs> I mean, if you think about it, you can wear multiple rings on the same finger. Oh yeah, oh, you can have yeah. more than ten. It's just your whole family generation in your hands. It's, it's tradition. And also you can hide it, so people wouldn't know you were wearing like 15 different rings. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> the, the only flaw with that logic is, is that um, it, the ring of mind shielding requires attunement, and I think you, you can only have up to three or five attunements no. at a time. Oh. Oh. Also, I've been looking at Radiant Weapon. What level Artificer are you? Oh, that's true. Two? You're two, right? Yes. It is a sixth level Artificer uh, mm, fusion. fusion. Oh. You couldn't get uh, Enhanced Weapon, though. Okay, let me delete that and look at another one. Okay, uh, okay. Another Replicate Magic item, right? Then oh, I yeah. Can... Get the goggles oh yeah yeah you could but like is the room is the whole palace well lit <laughs> right that's the thing that i've been slipping through um i can't find anything that suggests that the room that the palace is dimly lit so i assume it's well lit okay oh. i don't assume you need it yeah let me look at is oh you can have a sending stone or another alchemy jug <laughs> uh, sending stone sounds pretty good. What is the sending stone? It's 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 a it's a walkie-talkie. Yeah. Oh, we could do that, but I already have what you call that oh. message and trip. Uh, message. But it's you... only like a hundred and twenty yeah. feet, though. Yeah. I don't know how big this palace is. <laughs> sending sending stone is is quite far apart. Yeah, I think it's like on, as long as you guys are in the same plane. Question mark. I think so too. Uh, where can I find the infusions? Uh, I'll send you the infusions. I'll send so it I'm in like which light? In the inside the oh? thing. Oh, what what do you mean? Oh, oh. in the uh, foundry. Like drag it in. Oh, you can import it. Right? Uh, or you, you cannot? You, I can, I can. Um, okay. uh, let me know which infusion you want and I'll drag it in for you. Okay, time to Google Artificer Infusion. Yes. <sighs> Although, I think... Um, I'm suspecting that it's mm -hmm. already inside based using. on based oh, on how using. it works. It's just that it's just that the, the UI is a bit convoluted for for getting for adding infusions. Mm -hmm. So I guess while we're doing this I can try to figure it out. Uh, okay. Infuse item. Where is it? I can't find it. Um, 
Yeah, like in foundry. Hmm. Enhance weapon. Then. Hmm? Enhance, yeah, weapon. enhance weapon. Yeah. Okay. Plus one bonus to attack and damage. That'll be nice. Just an extra thing of damage. Yep. Yep. Uh, and I don't think we need the sending stone because I, I don't think we want to split the party. <laughs> oh, okay, I found it. Uh, enhanced weapon, right? Yes. Enhanced weapon. Did it get added? Uh, what uh, is this? Wait, that's not a... It's not feet, it's not dex. Uh... Uh, is Shizu back? Yeah. Oh, yes, okay. Yes, Shizu back. Um, um, I think for now we'll, we'll just... We'll just... Uh like make a little note because i couldn't drag it in mm -hmm. or if it was dragged in i don't know where it was dragged into oh i see okay yeah so make a little note that you can do enhanced weapon and we'll continue on okay oh, i found it <laughs> um so you move on in the next room and you see a bunch of little people Thing around. Let me just. Hello, little people. But they're frozen in time. Uh, oh. 16. It's just <laughs> everything frozen here. <laughs> Pretty much. Um, an oh. eight foot tall, three foot diameter, multi colored cake rests on a large round table in this kitchen, which also contains a stove and assortment of mismatched cupboards and work tables. Eight pixies are suspended in mid air around the cake. Each wearing a chef's hat and a and a flower stained, and a flower stained apron. <clears throat> six, uh, six of the pixies squeeze cloth tubes that have icing coming out of them. The other two hold armfuls of tiny crimson candles. Thick creepers with broad leaves encroach on the kitchen through a partially open door in the middle of the concave wall. The roots stretch across the floor and coil around the large table but not around a smaller rectangular, rectangular wheeled table that has three trussed up giant rats on it. Ooh. Oh. So uh, the, the smaller rectangular table with the giant rats are right next to... Oh. Uh, right next ah. to... Um, uh, oh. Sainaris. <laughs> are they frozen okay. too? Why is... Why is my controls frozen? What? Oh no. I guess the spell also affected you. No. <laughs> <laughs> can I can I move this? Okay. Well, at least I can manually move the Wait, what? N hmm? Nani? Okay, let me just refresh my own page. <laughs> okay. Um, so yes, uh, what do people want to do here? Uh, hmm. So there's just a giant cake here? Yeah, there's a, there's a giant multi-tiered cake here with eight, uh, eight pixies. Uh, no, no, it's not going bad. It, oh. it, it looks, it looks as fresh as it when it was just baked. It's like your cupcake. It's still fresh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! It's, it's the same. <laughs> they ate it still. It's the same for everything here that that is frozen in time. They they all look as as um. Well, like it looks like their freshness is also frozen in time. It's How well bad preserved. Is it to, like take a slice. I'd... Looks at Osiria. Mm. <laughs> uh, I feel I'd... kind of bad. Maybe not you're still decorating it. <laughs> Well, to be uh, fair, a cake this big, it might be someone's birthday, maybe, yeah, when we unfreeze them. Someone. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> maybe. All right. 
Okay. I'll make you a good berry cupcake. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. We can just bake you one. Oh, what's this room? Yes. Yeah, so there's there's a huge vine that that um. Come on, where are my controls? There's. Okay. I'm wondering, should we go here? <laughs> so this looks like a trap. Um, an open doorway leading from the kit. Uh, sorry, L leading from mm -hmm. the kitchen. Uh, has sick creepers spreading through it. Here, the palace has been torn asunder by the growth of an enormous beanstalk that has lifted one of its towers high into the air. The space beyond the open doorway is choked with rubble and thick roots that form the bean beanstalk's base. So, if you remember the the picture of um, uh. What's that? Uh, the the picture of the Palace of Hearts Desires. There's one oh, tower yeah. that there was like a vine thing. Yeah, there's carrying one... a thing. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder if there's a giant up there. <laughs> no, where did they say the giant was? The Fomorians. Uh, the doorway on the the the, the door on the right. The door down the corridor oh, on the right. Yeah. Okay, this is the door we should not go into. <laughs> but it's also the door you need to get into to it's the most direct path to to the to the um to the thing you're looking for. To the ah. injury. Um, we can climb the beanstalk. Oh, we're gonna be Jack. <laughs> <What> are... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if we need to come down, we have feather fall. Oh, oh, and I have a broom. I think most of us I... can fly. <laughs> yeah, I'll just say we my little We did get over pet. one of the towers. Yeah. True. Hmm. So, but do we know what this path is? The other one? The left side? You didn't ask? Oh. Let's go you back. Just said the right is... <laughs> you just said the right is the most direct. Yeah. Uh, do we want to climb the vine or go... To Free the owl first, so that we don't have to fight my trauma. <laughs> Free the owl. Uh, Are you open? Oh. Who's opening the door? Oh, I, I closed am... the door. <laughs> <laughs> how how loudly not... did you close the door? Um, how how loudly did uh <laughs> how loudly did Ligma tell me to shut the who opened the door? I'm whispering in a loud voice. Oh, <laughs> uh, then I frantically close it as quietly as I can. <laughs> How do you do that? <laughs> Give me a stealth check. Come on. I'll just check it against. Right? Huh? Sorry. Disadvantage. No, no disadvantage. Just no. give me a stealth check. I'll check it against its passive perception. Oh, is it giant? Like, 26. <laughs> you were as stealthy as you are certain you are. Okay. <laughs> Hopefully. Now we go to this end. I yeah, don't want to go fight. <laughs> That's okay. I oh, you're flying on my broom, right? Yeah. I should group us into. Wait, why is this here? Wait, I just... can't group us into one. What? Hmm? What's where? No, there was there was something somewhere that it shouldn't be, so I just quickly moved it. Okay. You just quietly and sneakily. Oh, did, do you want to cast pass without trace or not? <laughs> oh, that would be useful. <laughs> yes, we can cast. You can cast pass without trace to all of us. Everyone has to be like within each other's. Hmm? Has to be within 20... 30 feet radius. Oh, 30 feet radius. So we're fine. For Zandi. It? Yeah, yeah. For Zandi the coast. Oh, right here. <laughs> <laughs> Is this everyone? Is this everyone? No, it's not everyone. Yeah, Camille and Esadiel are busy tormenting things. <laughs> Just reading his ring collection that everyone knows is very important to him. What if he just has a lot of rings of mind shielding? Okay, there's from from the interaction you can you can get the get the sense that Kamiel is in particular interested in one of the rings that seems to be uh, slightly magical. 
Oh. Well, he's fine. He's gonna steal it anyway. Oh, there's another no. staircase here. We have no another idea door. Any of these leave. Yes. Um, you come up to this door and then you find that it is locked. Uh, but there is the symbol of a. Uh, oh wow, the. There's a symbol of a lion on on this on this lock. Oh, we can use the bell thing. The I forgot what it's called. Oh, the 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 bell that I wanted to unlock all the windows with. <laughs> yes, but you didn't. I told you not to. The Aww. bell of I don't, I don't know what it's called, but uh, it unlocks stuff for us. Chime of opening or something like that. Yeah, yeah. Who has the it, time for... by the way? Uh, I think I do. Yes, I do. I have a chime somewhere here. I think. <laughs> uh, I ring the thing. Uh, Does anything ring. happen? Yeah, you ring it and, and you hear a little click as the door unlocks. Oh, nice. So it works on these doors as well. Oh my god. <laughs> um, yes. Um, so. I will sneakily just try to open the oh, door. Oh, uh, hello? <laughs> what is this? Absolute speedrun. Okay. That didn't happen, but. <laughs> just close the door again. <laughs> I mean. A close door. Oh, yeah, <laughs> cool. Okay. Okay. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, a, a grand ballroom lies before you. The northern part of, of its floor is littered with splintered remains of three doors that have been knocked from their hinges, leaving openings through which you can see adjoining rooms. Throughout the ballroom, royal courtiers stand motionless, their eyes fixed on a black iron cauldron atop of a dais in the middle of the chamber. Black vapors rise from the cauldron and a huge dragon-like monster is coiled around it. The dragon's body twitches slightly and its eyes and, and its closed eyelids flutter as it dreams. Two figures are uh two figures are frozen, statue-like off to one side of the cauldron. An imperious middle-aged woman with long white hair and white robes, uh, I, I guess green robes, um uh and a younger woman clad in armor <clears throat> wearing a white cape. The older woman is reaching desperately towards the cauldron, while an, while the armored woman at her side is grasping a fine-looking quarterstaff. Um, uh, uh, she was... Blah. And Andy immediately recognizes the middle-aged woman with long white hair as uh, Zibona. Oh. Can we gently close the door again? I think we need the owl Wait, first. Are any of them are yeah. any of them like are all of them frozen in time? Yes. Except, Except for the, the Jabber Jabberwock. Missing. Yeah. Okay. Uh do you guys think oh do you guys have a silent spell? We could just walk by. Okay, what do you mean? A silent spell. So that we don't wake up the Jabberwock. I could just alternatively cast darkness around it, but <laughs> <laughs> we can I don't cast know. a silent spell with the pass without trace. But we have to be hide somewhere. I don't know where to hide around here in the ballroom. Mm. Okay, I guess it's either this or we fight or we try to go through the Fomorian. I have... Which I don't hmm? Oh no. I technically have Two casts of invisibility if we only need two people in there. Oh. Hmm. We could give you all the horns and you cast invisibility on yourself and you just keep trying it on Zibilna. No! Yeah. <laughs> but RNG is so bad! We need someone. No, but you who... have so much high stealth. Plus yeah. pass without trace. No, no I have disadvantage because of There's my. A jabber. <laughs> You could remove your Just armor. Just reminding you all, there's a we'll jabber wall. <laughs> yeah, there's a... Uh, mm. Well, I guess we have to go to the direct route. I'm pretty sure it's easier to kill a Fomorian than a jabber wall. <laughs> Dang. 
Oh well. Go back around. I do we not. Can I this. do not want. Yes, as you see, I'm going back. You just see Sinaris's hands are just trembling. <laughs> ah. Feels bad for Sinaris. I do not Aww. want to fight that thing. I give hug. Oh. But he does. He is tempted to fireball it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. The little boy has grown a bit of courage. <laughs> yeah. Or chaos. We sneakily opened the door. Sneakily. Yes. Can we just crawl <laughs> all the way on the ground so it doesn't see us? Okay. All oh, right. You guys want pass without trace, <laughs> and then we mm. like fly in the corner, like top corner or what bottom corner. About? Just somewhere in the corner. Uh, above? Above it? Preferably with... Not with an eye level. <laughs> yes. Uh, okay, yeah. Give me a pass without trace stealth rolls. Um, okay. Wait, wait, wait. I'm gonna cast it first. And then there's extra stuff. I forget how this works. Okay, okay. Isn't it a flat... Uh, thing? Yeah, flat... Plus it's, 10 to yeah, our roll. Yeah, plus, plus 10, yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Stealth. So everyone's rolling stealth. Plus 10. Oh, forgot to plus 10. So that's 27 for you. Oh. That's 22. That's 31. <laughs> oh, wait, no, that's 21, yeah. And that's 19. Oh, wait. 12? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, uh, you're all stealthy. Um, so I'll describe what you see. Uh, paint paintings of fake creatures and mounted heads of majestic elk with golden horns decorate the walls of this dining hall. In the middle of the hall, a deformed giant squats at the head of a table uh, with a... My bad. I placed it in what? the wrong place. Uh... I mean, no, please. Why? Why does? Uh, yeah. Um, I mm -hmm. I placed it in the middle, but it should be at the head. So okay, I'll shift the token in a bit. Um. Okay. Why is everything frozen? What? Is oh, anyone no. able to drag the screen? Characters are awesome. Uh, yeah, I'm able to grab the uh, screen. Okay. I, I think it might be my own fine. network connectivity issue. Oh no. Uh, let me just refresh for the thing. Okay, let okay me now I cannot drag, drag anything. Oh. <laughs> okay. Um, where was I? Uh, you were describing. Uh, yes. Uh, for Morin, giant sits, uh, squats at the head of the table piled with food. The grease stained tablecloth is stuck under the giant's chin, uh, which I suppose mm. you can't see. Um, mm. And she washes down each slobbering mouthful of food with a gulp from the, from a barrel of beer. Oh. A tea cart in one corner of the banquet hall has an iron kettle and a tureen of steaming soup resting on dollies atop of it, which is just to the right. Oh, okay. No. Okay. Um and and yeah, you guys are so stealthy and and she is so distracted with food that she doesn't hear you. Oh no, why is everything frozen? So, we can enter now? Yes, you yes. can enter and you want to fly to the top of the room, right? Hmm. Or do you guys want to sneak under the table? Um, we can go to the top. I think I still have okay. my spider thing. This is, wait, 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 before that, is like yeah. the ceiling high enough for us to fly above? It's quite high, actually. Uh, you see those dotted oh. lines? There's an, yeah. there's, there's actually a, a, a second line. Yeah, it's a balcony to this room. Oh. So if you're flying up, I need to actually copy-paste you guys into the, into the upper floor. Okay, oh. we will fly up then. I can... I mean... I can just share the lily pad with Elliot. Oh yeah, yes. yeah. Yeah. Please do. I clamber onto the lily pad, thank you. <laughs> Whoa. 
Uh, where are we? Uh, where did it taste you guys? I don't know. I have no idea. I don't know where I am. I don't even see myself. Uh, We're on the other side of this lightning thing. I'm just gonna control Z and then just manually drop you guys. Yeah, <laughs> I'll, I'll activate this map. And okay. then... You do not own any token in this scene, that's fine. Um, just, just, please. Uh, players. Endercos. Uh, Elliot. Rosiria. Uh, Sainawi. Sainawi. And... Uh, where is yes. the audience token? <laughs> Remember the TikTok I sent you, Kismet? <laughs> the baguette. Oh. <laughs> okay. I will use we... the baguette as, as a weapon. weapon. <laughs> <laughs> but yes, uh, you are now above the Pomorian who is just down here still slobbering food. Okay. Oh. Um. Hmm. I don't know if we should go up, like, to wherever this thing is, this door. Pretty sure we shouldn't be there yet, because he said it was on the ground floor, right? Uh, the former. The aviary. Oh yeah, the aviary is on the ground floor. Okay. Um, but so... you know, you now have access to whatever's on this floor, which is, by the way. Um, mm -hmm. ah. there's a harpist caught in this room. It's, it's it's all it's 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 all there is really about this room. Um, oh, uh, there's there's so there there's a door to to the left of 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 this floor and a door at the end of the hallway. Uh, I'll just mm -hmm. put this here so that stream can see. Why is that door oh. visible? Seems I have no clue. Oh no, what's wrong with my walls? Is it open? No, it's locked. Okay, so that door is a window, which it should not be. Uh, there we go. And then there is a wall there that, that is actually missing. So let me just put that oh. wall in. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's good. Um, yes, and then... And then uh, yeah, so there's there's a door at the end of this hallway and uh, uh a door on the left side that is there's a uh lion's uh the lion symbol on it. Uh oh. this court. Wait, is the lion symbol uh a wall? Uh for some reason like... it's casting a shadow, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so the 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 the, yeah. the, the thing is that I wasn't expecting people to be uh on how do I phrase it? On this side. Like I needed I needed to put a a, a, a wall for the railing of the oh. balcony. But but mm. but also I, I needed the lion symbol to be visible. So I put like a little oh. wall around it. Okay. I see. Um so mm -hmm. Yes. So uh this is the minstrels gallery. It's it's where it's where like if there's a uh banquet going on down below, there will be like uh performers up here playing background music. Mm -hmm. Uh this 30 foot high balcony overlooks the banquet hall. A harpers court decorated with painted panels is situated at one end of the balcony near the double door. Oh. Yeah, so there's a harpers Ooh. court near this door. Hmm. I guess we'll take note of that when we want to go back here. Um, I'll just is fly over to the other end of the room. Is there anything notable about the Harpist Court? Hmm. Um. Are you casting Detect Magic? Uh. No. No, then it just looks like it's in really good condition. Okay. Um, 
for now, I guess we're just gonna go to the other side of the of the room, so that we can get to the aviary. Okay. If we go down, will the giant see us? Uh, the giant will have line of sight of you. Yes. Ooh. Oh. Direct line oh, of sight. No. Yeah. We just close the door and leave. Let's fine. Let's fine. <laughs> That's fine. I'm pretty sure it's too busy eating to care about anything. Are you sure? <laughs> yeah. I look. Up. I don't know. I could always we're like... like the only other things to move here in a while. That's true. Uh, from what you can see, she is running out of food, and she still oh. looks oh. very hungry. Oh. So we just give her all our rations. <laughs> Oh, give her a good berry. Doesn't a good berry satiate you for, like, the whole day? Yeah, that's what it does. Uh, it <laughs> gives you enough nutrients for the whole day. that size. <laughs> oh. Oh. Doesn't... I thought it, like, makes you feel full or something. I mean, if, if, you're, if, you, if you have enough nutrients, you won't feel full. But then... Uh, no, if you have enough nutrients, you, you, you won't feel hungry. But... Mm -hmm. It doesn't stop you from having cravings. And oh, if, if you're a glutton for food, you're just going to keep eating even if you're full. Just give her all 10 of the good berries. <laughs> uh, well, okay. I mean... I'm just going <laughs> to... So you're, you're flying down, right? Yes, we are flying I down. Could, I could, like, give the good berry, mm -hmm. like, for a while. I mean, no. 10 good berries Give it isn't like, a lot. Just use all your spell slots for good berries. No. <laughs> just feed it. Just, just buff it with other, like, rations, I guess. Yeah, I still have a bunch of rations. I think. Okay. Uh, yes, we are down. So, you're down, and then now she has line of sight of you. She... She 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 sees you. Oh, Carex minions! Oh, I was just I'm just about to finish my food. Bring me more. Oh, Carex minions. Oh, um. Uh, we'll go get more food for you. Um, Osiria. Oh, I well, it's not just more food I want. Yeah, Kalek like promised me that, that there's a cake for me. Eight tiers high, lit with blood red candles and icing white as snow. Oh. Bring it to me. Oh, it's the cake that we saw. Okay. I guess we'll get the cake for you. Good, um, good. If I see you return without the cake, I will eat you. I will gobble you up just to see how you taste and see if you taste as sweet as you look. Oh. Gross. Do we okay. be fighting this guy or? I don't know. Did um, I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure Zabilna can handle them when they're back. Uh, can we open Unless the they're door like a guest. Hmm? What? Can we open the door behind us? Uh, yes, you can. <clears throat> yes, okay. but I'd rather like. If we do pass by here again, I'd rather have it not angry at us. So I'm gonna yeah. go get the cake. Uh, was it on like a... Uh... Hmm? That's not done, right? I don't yeah, know. Was it done? done. It was, it was yeah. in the process of being done, but most of the icing and candles are there already. Okay. Uh, so basically the cake is done. Up. Yep. I'm gonna say I'm scrawny and skinny. I, I don't think there's much to eat. <laughs> Wait, why, is, why is this here? What? What? Don't worry, Andakos. Camille would eat you. I'm so confused. Why? <laughs> 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 is this fine? Um, kind of feel yeah. bad. Why? What do you mean? I mean, I guess... Is it... it I don't know. Are they I'm a guest sure. of the place? I'm not sure if the cake is actually for the giant. Because you know but... how, like, they're frozen. Oh, yeah. And the giant before? isn't frozen. Was, was the giant here before everyone was frozen? 
Uh, I assume I not it's... because they're not frozen. Yeah. So, was is this cake really for the giant? Is my question. But at the same time, I wouldn't gamble with their lives, you know. <laughs> like it's just a cake. Yeah, it's just yeah, a cake. They can, they can make, make another, another one. one. But it's so big. I feel bad. Oh, it's oh, okay. Oh yeah, it's still it's still our lives. <laughs> um. Is it on some sort of like movable table? Yeah, it's something? it's it's on a it's on a cart of some sort. Oh, a trolley. Thing? Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> okay, we shall bring <clears throat> it to them then. I'll just scooch over. Can you move the? What are these fairies? Pixies. <laughs> yeah, oh, the, yeah, the pixies. You can, you can kind of of like they're not directly touching the, the cake, so you can kind of just move it past them. Um, Okay. But there are vines coiled around the the, the, the table, so you'll you'll need to figure out oh. the vines. Oh, can we um, cut the vine? <laughs> He's just gonna burn the whole tree. The whole <laughs> burn the entire thing down. <laughs> can we cut can it? We just cut it. Yeah, can we cut it? Um, let me see. Be like water bender, and we bend the water inside the plant. <laughs> 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 I mean, you guys do. You have shape water, right? Yeah, I don't think it works that way. It, it works on liquids. That's... Yes, I could wrap it in the liquid. The liquid inside <laughs> of. <laughs> no. Okay, let's see. Um. It's like you're trying to achieve blood bending, but with blood. <laughs> yes. Yes. You. Uh, what do you want to do to the beanstalk? We kind of just want to cut this portion okay. of the vine. Not the whole beanstalk. Okay, uh, roll to hit. Uh... I think Elliot has the oh, best chance of doing this. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's already 12, so I think, like... Yeah, yeah, yeah you can go eat. Like... Yep, we'll see you later. Um... Uh, what's what's the to hit? Also enjoy Ellie. your food. My to hit? Yeah. yeah, yeah. We're trying to cut the vine, right? Oh, I see the sword. Yep. So make your attack roll. Attack. Eleven. <laughs> um, you. Your your sword just just your 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 sword doesn't even dent the 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 vine. Oh. Oh no. Bonfire. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we I mean, could. We could. Nothing's not okay. Does anyone have spare water lying around? So if it spare water. goes, yeah. So if it goes. Oh past yeah. The thing, I can, then we can uh conjure up some water with my alchemy jug. Okay, cool. Yes. I take out my s sticks and stuff and create bonfire. <laughs> oh, yeah, you create a bonfire uh, where the vine is, and it it, j it looks like it's not burning. Oh. Oh. Ooh. Dang. It's magic. It's magic. Okay. Uh... What if we just lift how the cake? About... <laughs> yeah. How about we roll it onto the lily pad? Oh yeah, we just roll it onto the lily pad. <laughs> yeah, you I'm can. I'm pretty sure the lily pad can. <clears throat> okay. Yes. We put it on the lily pad. I will light some of the candles with pressed digitation. I think I can do that. Yeah. 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 And then we put it on. Can a cake even fit through the door? Uh, yes. Yes, I it can. can. Yes. <laughs> just <Okay>. barely. <laughs> God. Yes, yes. The... Okay. the... Or... The pixies were, mm -hmm. were were very careful to make sure that the cake that they were baking can actually fit through the doorway. Oh. <laughs> Otherwise, they're not going to be able to present it to her if they can't get it out of the kitchen. Oh. <laughs> okay. So we just bring it over. Yeah. Here you go, giant Fomorian. Uh, she, she, she sees it and she goes, ah, good, good. <coughs> and then she... She she just takes her hand and and scoops into it with her hands and starts shoving pieces of cake into her mouth. 
Um, oh, oh, gross. It's, it's, it's <laughs> a really large cake, so at the rate that she's going, you more or less can guess that she'll take about three hours before she's done eating with the cake and probably still hungry afterwards. Jeez. Okay, let's okay. go to the other door. Real yes, quick. let's go to the other side. Oh. Oh, sliding with wall. What? What? No, something wrong. Oh, probably trying to move diagonally. Okay, where did they say it was? Uh, down the That's hallway that. on your right. So I guess from the perspective, it would be uh, above. Here, I guess. Yeah. yeah. All right. Hello. Bloody bee. Oh, wow. Yeah. Um, Apiary. P20. Okay. An enormous owl stands perfectly still in the middle of this room, its wings partially outstretched. A wall of iron bars stretch, uh, stretching from the floor to the ceiling forms a protective barrier around the chamber's entrance, keeping visitors separate from the owl. The wall across from the double, uh, the wall across from the double door has a twenty-foot wide circular opening sealed with hinged, semicircular windows in wrought iron frames. The marble floor is littered with the bones of giant rats. Oh. Giant rats. Oh, maybe we can feed the rats to the thing, <laughs> but I don't think we need to. <laughs> um, hello. Wait, is it frozen in time? Yes. No. Oh. Oh, no. Okay. Oh, but like here we're, we can safely try out the unicorn horn, right? Oh, yeah, with the mage hand. <laughs> yep. I pick up um, a unicorn yes. horn. We have four, right? Yeah, we have four. I pick I'll up the one, one that I didn't fail at. <laughs> yes. So one of the other three. And mm -hmm. I roll. <laughs> Which is the one that you didn't fail at? Uh, that was the unicorn costume. Okay. Unicorn costume. Okay. Wow. Twelve. Twelve. <laughs> you succeed. Oh, oh really? nice. <laughs> yeah. Uh, the the magic flows. Uh, as you, as you say, bloody beak to uh while, while touching it with the unicorn horn. Um, mm -hmm. and and uh bloody beak flutters back to life, and 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 it looks around. It looks at you. It it rushes towards the the. The uh, the bars, uh, but it's immediately stopped by it. Okay. Okay. Um. We say. I'll well, have Osiris say, like, oh, don't be alarmed. We're we're trying to help your owner. Um. um bad news. The builder. <laughs> hmm? Bloody beak is a rock, which is a monstrosity and not a beast. But it's an owl, right? <laughs> is it an owl? Um, Huh? A giant owl. I mean, I guess it doesn't really look like an owl. Yeah, from this one. Mm. Oh, actually. Oh no, that's within reach. Uh... Yeah, it's yeah. it's not. It's not a. Yeah, it's it's not it's not a, a it's it's not a beast, so it doesn't understand Bosiria. Oh, that is bull! It's a giant <laughs> owl. <laughs> okay, um, I guess Sainaris will just minor illusion, um, the Bilna into the like to his side, and then he points to the Bilna and say, "Friend." Our friend. <laughs> Give me an animal and link check. It's not an animal, but it's the closest I can think of. Okay. <laughs> oh, actually, it does say animal Monstrosity handling. Monstrosity handling. <laughs> hmm? Yeah, give me, give me an animal handling check. Okay. 
13. Uh, it 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 doesn't it doesn't understand you. It does it doesn't look like it's 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 believing you. Okay, wait, so so like like you know how I did like the disguise kit thing and like Yeah. You wanna turn into the never... wilderness? More like I don't think I I I, I... I dropped the disguise. Oh, you didn't take off the... Yeah, yeah you didn't okay, take it you, off. Give me your first... Your, your performance roll then. Oh, yeah. Uh, nice. Well, you're behaving like the builder, <laughs> but... Um, <clears throat> so And so it's not attacking you. Okay. Oh, it's not attacking me. Yeah, this command. No, it's, not, it's not attacking anyone, but it's not. It's it's not hostile towards you, I guess. Oh, okay. But but if you're gonna okay. command it, I'm gonna need you to, to give me another performance check. Oh, okay. Uh, I'll give you bardic inspiration then. <laughs> I I can wait. Can I cast it on myself? I can cast it on myself. Can you? Which one? Yes, I can. Oh. Bardic inspiration. Okay. Yeah. So you just do that. What are we commanding it to do? Uh. Hmm. We commanded to kill the Jabberwock. Yes. Okay. And maybe the last were friends. <laughs> performance. Performance. Uh, wait, how does this work? Oh, you get a plus two. Okay. Fifteen. Damn, that's a low roll. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> um, the bloody beak looks a bit doubtful by by your order, but but it's not doing. Uh, wait, are you are you telling it to to to? Wait, did did you tell it to um uh look for the Jabberwock? Uh yeah. Yes. Okay. Uh, look for it. Yeah. So Bloody Peak seems a little doubtful about it, but but it, it it it's not it's not completely opposed to the idea of 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 attacking the Jabberwock since oh for the first time in a really long time Zibuna has finally ordered me to to get rid <laughs> of that shit. Um. Yeah. So it waddles over to the, to to this giant uh. Uh, window that's behind it, and yeah. and and it 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 just looks at you expectantly. Oh, uh, does the chime have a range? Uh, or do I have to be right next to it? It, it has a range. It's it's a twin hundred and twenty feet. Oh, okay. I'll just point at the thing and then unlock it. Yeah. So. Uh yeah and 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 the it clicks unlock uh yes and um bloody beak just immediately flies out and you hear yeet and and after a bit you hear you hear like screeching and 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 uh and and crashing with with mm. other 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 noises that doesn't immediately come to mind as uh. <clears throat> As 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 uh, Bloody Beak immediately uh, starts circling around to the other side of the the the, the palace and um, and 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 it it, it breaks in into in into the uh, <clears throat> into the other rooms that you currently are not in. Uh, you hear a lot of of crashing and tumbling and, and and you actually feel a bit of shaking as they start fighting around inside the castle. Uh, before they they finally <clears throat> they finally take the the fight outside, where they have more space, and there and that's where you get that uh, that picture that that I've I've shown everyone so many times. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, where is where is it? Scroll, scroll, scroll. Please. Further, further. Show place. Yes. Oh, oh. Why are there bones? Oh, we freed Bloody Beak and we couldn't talk to them because they're an owl but a monstrosity. Ah. Uh. It's weird. But yes, we freed 
the thing, Bloody Beak, and now they're chasing away the Jabberwock. Nice. Good riddance. Oh, fuck. What? The Jabberwock looks what happened? a lot less scary with the owl chasing. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like a yeah. worm on a string. Yes. Okay, nice. Um, since the Jabberwock's not there anymore, I assume we can freeze the Bilna? We still have to deal with everyone else there. Isn't what there do you like mean? The, 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 the League? I d we didn't see the League, did we? Oh, we just no. saw Zibelna and there. some other we don't people. Know... We didn't ask what the League looks like. We only asked what Zibelna looks like. <laughs> yeah. But then, I don't know. They're all frozen in time anyway. Right? Oh, are they frozen as well? Uh, I just rest... know that they're guarding it. The rest of the people in the in the court, yeah. Not court, yeah. Uh, courtroom are um, all frozen in time. Frozen. Um... Okay, so we don't have to worry. For now. <laughs> I'll just cast us a darkness spell so that they're not, you know, doing anything. Wait, us? Couldn't yeah, around we be able to see? me. None of I would. I would be able to see. Mm. Okay, then. Okay. Um, We're just going to run room? past the Fomorian. Yeah, yeah. We're just going to run past the Fomorian. Um... You did give the cake, right? Yes. Yeah, we gave the cake. It's 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 just that if you <laughs> if you look at the map and, and think about it. <laughs> oh yeah, there's a lot more to explore. No, but... it's, it's it's that based on the layout of what you've seen so far. Mm hmm Like you're you're in a hallway where there's there's a little door here and based on oh. the size of the room. Oh, yeah, oh, we're yeah. just yeah, bringing just this right in, there. bro. We didn't have to go there. <laughs> Alright. Sainaris isn't very good at directions, nor floor planning. <laughs> so. I mean, is there like signages saying that it's the main hallway or something? No, there isn't. Like, going to the courtroom. Oh, okay. But, but yeah. So, yeah, um, he doesn't know. The, the, on, on, the, on the Reddit threads and forums, there's a lot of DMs complaining about the uh, Zipilna's. Um, a uh, uh, sense of architecture and oh. <laughs> our home design. Yeah. Jabber walk. I, yeah, that's a valid complaint. <laughs> yeah. I'm just gonna eat them out What's of the. What's a bloody cage next to a dining hall? I have no clue. <laughs> like, couldn't you hear the screeching of the owl as you eat in the banquet hall? <laughs> uh, they're all soundproofed magically. <laughs> okay. Um. Okay. Is it smell proof too? <laughs> uh, yes. Everything has has uh, pressy digitation making them smell great. Okay. <laughs> you guys go work on freeing Zabilna. I'll check if the rest of the rooms are locked. And I proceed to eat. I will go eat. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be right back. Or oh, we could just end it. Oh, actually, you know what? Um, do you we still have an hour. Okay. Okay, uh, so yes. yes. Silver Star never um, got here. <laughs> yeah, it's okay. I'll be right back. It's it's probably for the best for Kamiya because you never know what what Zipona is gonna do when she when she unfreezes. Okay, uh, so what's happening? I guess we pull out the unicorn horns again. Unicorn horns and start. Yeah. You know. Okay. Someone else wants to do it this time. This was so close. Don't have to. I need drop the disguise. I need to drop the disguise. <laughs> oh, you're still wearing it. <laughs> yeah. I wonder, did the giant see you like that? Did what? Like the giant. The giant. She saw you wearing it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Cool. Okay. <laughs> what if we all keep a distance? And whoever has Mage Hand, use the Mage Hand. <laughs> Wait, we all what? Like, we all just like, stand at a distance and whoever has Mage Hand, uses Mage okay. Hand. Oh, and maybe let's like, move everyone who's near. As well. Just away. Like, all of these people. 
It should be fine if I do it though, right? Uh, I, mean? I guess so. Do you want to try? She... I don't know like... if she would recognize Maybe me. Maybe let's move like all of the other people away. Just can we can we can we nudge the other people away? Yeah, yeah all the flying pixies. We just push them and they just float in the air. Um, yeah, <laughs> just not imagining. I think you can. I can't remember, but I think you can. I mean, they're like statues right now, so like let's just move them like they're statues. <laughs> yeah. Um. Vaguely, from what I remember, I think you can. Uh, where do you want to move them? Um, I guess like the northern part of the room. Okay. Which is far from. Yeah, it's a building. Anything else? Oh, not just the pixies though, like everyone surrounding. Oh. Is this the cauldron? Ooh. Yeah, this is the cauldron in the center. Um, right, so two quick things, and the, you know what? I, I'm gonna say you can easily move the pixies and the quick things, but the the Mer Merkion, uh, the the woman next to her might be difficult. She's wearing armor, right? Yeah. Oh. that one help me out here. <laughs> <I'll see. laughs> Do you, why? Why are you <laughs> yeah. trying to help? Fine, all of you make a strength check. Strength check. Uh, rip. Uh, <laughs> Once it, my strength actually worked. Yeah, but unfortunately, it's not Go enough heavy. to move her. Uh, do you think Zabilna's easier to move? <laughs> Why are you trying to move them? So like when we use the horns, all of the weird magical stuff don't <laughs> don't don't affect anyone else, you know? Yeah. It'll Maybe we be should just fine. trust Anacos and his RNG. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we step away. Yeah, step away. Here's all the horns, good luck. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Cool, so uh, which horn does Endercos use? I tell Endercos I had luck using the unicorn costume horn. Okay, I'll use the that one then. Okay, uh, roll, uh, what, what do you do? What, 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 what do you do with the horn? Um... Poke. <laughs> Oh, okay. And and the the name that you say um, is. There's a name I need to say. Yes, uh, you need to say the true name for uh t to break the the time freezing curse on them. Uh, uh, Wait, how am I meant to know the true name? Right. So that's... Shit. we have two names so far. That's the conversation with Tinnings, right? Tinnings said that her name is Igwilf. Yeah, and... Yeah. Yeah. Igwilf? Uh... Nothing happens. But... Oh, uh... Another horn? I think it's the name. It's... Yeah. You, Even you... if it's like... If it's the right name but wrong horn, it still does some magic weirdness. Mm. You poke her with, with a different horn and say Igwilf, but nothing happens either. Oh what no. What do you find her real name then? Do you think she signed anything around here? <laughs> do you think we can like... Oh wait, no. To unfreeze the girl next to Sedona, we'll probably need their name too. Yeah. Yes. Do we know um... anyone's name here? Yeah, if we can freeze and be like, excuse me, <laughs> asking for name. I think chances are everyone in here will say that her name is Zibona, so... Oh. Um, do you think there's a library Okay, let's go. Do you think the... 
the giant eating the cake would know. Because that's the only awake person who's probably been here for a while. Hmm, we could try. <laughs> gonna go awkwardly open the door real quick. Oh, uh, I didn't door? write it down, just... but I feel like it only mentions one name, which is a wolf. I kind of peek my head out and um, oh. shout at the giant. I was like, Excuse me, sir. Ma'am, do you know the. It's a oh, woman. excuse me, ma'am. <laughs> Do, do, do you know the name of um, the owner of this uh, this is castle? One right? one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's the Donut's castle. It's the Donut's castle. I mean, okay. Thank you. <laughs> Closes the door. Awkwardly mm. walks away. I don't think. I don't think she knows. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, there's still the entire other part of the palace we haven't explored. Maybe we can find a trace of her name here? Maybe. Of the beanstalk? <laughs> Perhaps? I will ask the staff. <laughs> hmm. It's tough oh, yeah, to pass a spell. Talk to plants? It <laughs> yeah. is. I don't have it though, right now. Hmm. Are the, are the are plants lost? also like frozen in time? Are the or what? Are not counted? The plants. Um, okay. So the plants in the garden are frozen in time. Uh, but the beanstalk doesn't appear to be frozen in time. It 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 looks like it's it's ever so slightly swaying in there as you move around it. Oh. oh. So we go to the beanstalk. I mean, I guess we don't have the spell, but we can always go up the beanstalk. <laughs> yeah. We could. Yeah. Maybe we can have a look. I'm gonna call Sainers. I can't move Sainers, but let's just assume that we have this room and him. <laughs> Okay, where's Sainari's token? Oh, over there. Okay. In the corner. Oh, there's also this tower. Tower staircase. This goes down, right? Uh, it goes up. Ooh. Oh. Uh, but we see the second f Um, not really. Yeah, let's go up then. Okay. Let's have a peek what's there first. <laughs> is- is Endercoast coming? Ye. Can't go Ye. through walls. Can't go through walls. I'm oh yeah. Yoink you over <laughs> here. Okay. Just uh let's just scoop up all of you and join you through the stairs. Thank and you. And then I need to activate this page <clears throat> and delete your extra characters. I just realized there's no audience token oh. here. Door. Let's open it. What's that? Okay, so uh, so first of all, um, this room is fourteen H. Fourteen H. Oh, P fourteen H. Okay, so the spirals, uh. So you, you go up the, the spiral staircase. Uh, this spiral staircase ascends to uh, uh, an area. Blah, blah, sorry. Okay, so there's there's the there's the door below that 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 uh, that's a balcony that overlooks the court of storms, uh, which I'll describe in a bit. And um, floating ten feet above the top of the staircase is a banshee, also trapped in temporal stasis. Uh, so, the court of storms that you, the the balcony that you look into, where is it? There we go. Uh, this rectangular courtyard is open to the twilight sky. It has no visible floor, 
Instead, a vortex of dark clouds churns below. A marble tower rising from the maelstrom is encircled by seven turrets. Four stone staircases extend from the outer areas of the palace to the tower, each one part of a buttress that spans the void and stabilizes the tower. Uh, oh, and since you're from here, that you can kind of see, uh, oops, you can kind of see like there's a hole in, in the wall across. Part of the, the tower wall has exploded outwards and its stony fragments are hanging in the air, as though time around them has stopped. <laughs> Among the debris, oh, suspended above the stormy <laughs> vortex is an armored knight with a sword in one hand and a shield in the other arm. He looks like he was thrown backwards, uh, backward through the exploding wall before being frozen in place. Oh no. Uh, yeah, oh no. Should we save the guy? Is the storm frozen too? Uh, the storm is not frozen, but the debris oh, is. Oh, ho, ho. Hmm. It is not the guy's frozen though, there. right? Oh uh, yeah, the guy's frozen. He's just above the storm. I do I need to pee really them. Mei Chan him up, right? <laughs> uh, yeah, you can. Uh, Mei Chan has a weight limit, and he is he exceeds the weight limit. I need to go to the toilet. Oh. Be right back. Hello. What oh, happened? Hi. I will be oh, very quickly guys. back. What happened? If he's going to the toilet, I'm We're going to the toilet. Door. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we just tried the name on Zedilda, and it didn't work. Oh. And so. We're going around trying to look for a name. Scarlet or someone that tell us the name. Oh, Scarlet, you mean? You didn't ask the cat. I but we don't know where the cat, cat is. Wait. The cat isn't is with, the cat with us? Yes. I'm pretty sure it doesn't want to die, so it will stay with us. Oh. Yeah, we should probably ask the cat. <laughs> yeah, let's ask the cat. <laughs> yes. Because, like, your mission was to find Natasha, and so far the cat hasn't complained, like, why aren't you going to Natasha? So I feel like you're going in the right direction. But I feel like we don't want to help out. <laughs> I'm afraid Probably I don't want to go back. Like, I don't want to hmm? go why? to Baba Yaga. Yeah. Why is there a banshee here? They're kind of just floating there, don't know what their deal is. Okay, but... I have returned. Invite me. Okay, we have decided we want to talk to uh, Winky. Uh huh, yes. Scarlet Mane? Uh, yes, Scarlet Mane is, is just uh, looking at you all expectantly and he's like, yes. What is it? We... Um. You've been with us, like, throughout the whole journey. And, and I've been you judging you the whole journey. Well, yes. Thanks for that. Silently. <laughs> but you haven't, like, complained that we're going in the wrong direction for whatever reason. Like, wherever Natasha is. Um. No, I think you are very much on the right path. Although, strayed ever so slightly, but... Still on the right path. <laughs> Relatively. It seems like you know more than we think you do. And since you're like Obayaga's familiar, do you know Zabilna's true names? Possibly. Would you tell us? Hmm. But where's the fun in that? I mean... There's no sense in Don't dying, the so <laughs> you just throw the cat into the store. <laughs> wait, wait! <laughs> Do you really want to think about this? <laughs> hmm. I don't know. Where's the fun in that? <laughs> <laughs> Give me your intimidation back. <laughs> okay. Intimidation. Uh, 20. Oh, boy. Whoa. oh my god. Whoa. Oh, whoa. <laughs> okay, okay, I'll tell you. I'll tell you. <laughs> <laughs> it's, 
it's a it's a it's a funny side track but uh if you really think about it Zibil uh Zibildar is the is is also known as Igwil the Witch Queen and um before she was Igwil the Witch Queen she was a known archmage for her studies in demonology she was known as Tasha Oh oh but Tasha is not her true name either in fact it is a shortened version of her name and and this, is, she, this is where Tasha? this is where he looks very expectantly <laughs> at, at Osiria. Oh Natasha Oh Unless that's, so that's who you <laughs> Yeah oh. that's who you needed to meet I don't want to go back to Baba Yaga. I don't know what I want to do now. It's okay, um, Osiria. No matter what happens, we'll sort it out. I won't let Baba Yaga take you back as her pet. You. But, um, <laughs> I stop <laughs> hanging... I stop hanging Saralamine <laughs> over the edge. <laughs> okay, thank you. Um, you guys mentioned someone falling? Go, go, go out the door. Oh, cool <laughs> beans. Okay, so he's not dying yet or anything. Yeah, um, he's in the process of dying. Uh, he's dying he, he, but is, not dead. he is just one round away from uh, Death. dying. Okay, um, can I? Would flying be a bad thing to do? The storm in isn't this frozen. Uh, the storm isn't frozen, but it is beneath you. Will it suck me in if I fly? Uh, anyone got some strong rope? <laughs> I could just mage hand a rope over and then pull over him to us. Yeah. Oh, true. Like the mage hand can tie the rope. Yeah, hey. yeah. And then we just pull it. Okay, how, I'll do that. How long is the rope? Long? 50 feet? Oh, yeah. 50 oh. Feet. Oh. Nice. nice. Enough to tie. Then yes, you can do it. Um, give me your dexterity, uh, your your sleight of hand check to to tie the rope with one mage hand. Okay. Or you can have two mage hands if oh. you use Elliot's as well. well. Oh yeah, with uh, Elliot's hand. Uh, with advantage then. <laughs> okay. Nice. Oh. Okay. Then. <laughs> yeah, you nice. you the, the the two mage hands work together very well. You manage to tie the rope around. Um, <clears throat> around the the man that his stands neck. there, around his <laughs> <No>. neck. <laughs> I mean, a, a slip knot can be uh, not a slip knot. Uh, uh, the the no. gallows knot can be done with one no. hand. No. Oh yeah. Oh no. Then they can actually slip that around no. his neck and and pull no. it over. No. Oh, I would rather not. Thank you. Tied <laughs> around his waist. Oh, yes. <laughs> Okay, I give the rest of the rope to you guys and we just pull him towards us. Yeah. Uh, and yeah, you, you managed to pull him over towards you. Uh... Okay, so... Mm -hmm. It was it was easy enough to tie it around him. Yeah. But once you actually start displacing him from his original position, you feel the weight as it, as it starts to swing downwards. Uh, oh, uh, so you gotta pull a lot quicker. Give everyone, give me a, 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 a strength check together. Okay, so we all do one strength check. Uh, yeah, yeah. Each of you do do a uh, do. Give me okay. an athletics check. Uh, the DC is fifteen. That that uh, at least half of you need to to succeed. Oof. The party with the wimpiest <laughs> muscles. <laughs> This is so sad. <laughs> I'm putting guidance on myself. Okay. <laughs> Still bad. <laughs> Even no. worse. <laughs> Wait, um, no, that's already half. Okay. Um. Yeah, he starts swinging downwards while you guys are, are pulling him him uh, no. uh, uh, uh towards you, and um. He he is uh. How, how do I phrase this? Uh, he he slips downwards by five feet. 
while uh. while while coming closer towards you. I have my broom helps. <laughs> it can lift four hundred pounds. <laughs> can we put some leverage on it? Is there like a pole here that we can um, leverage it from? I'm not sure. We don't have molder. <laughs> Wait, yeah, you do. Why? Oh, okay, I've prepared my spell book. You think I can make like a little leverage for it to like? Yeah, sure. To? You could probably do that I'm gonna if do the that. castle is made of earth. <laughs> is there anything I can mold earth around here? Uh, or mm. it yeah, looks like stone. I mean, there's there's the the balcony itself, like the aesthetic little things here. Okay, you can use that and make a leverage for I'm us to make, like, pull better. <laughs> yeah, with earth. <laughs> oh, okay. I just realized this was here the whole time. Yes. Wait, is it just me or I see some Skabatha over there? Skabatha? Wait, how, how, where? Over there. Huh? Down uh, next to the person. Uh, yeah, you, you can you can you're you're kind of in a in a rush to to save this guy right now. But but yeah, in the corner of your eye, you do notice that the scabasta is uh uh <clears throat> sitting there in the corner, just kind of watching you guys pull him. <laughs> pull him out, I uh, wave hi. The way he's saying hi. You, you wave hi while you're trying to pull this guy. No. <laughs> You wave with your antlers. With my antlers? I, I didn't I know they moved on their own. <laughs> 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 no, no, I meant my head. <laughs> okay, uh, everyone give me, give me that uh, athletics check again. Oh I no. I miss. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. I'll just put wait, more dick inspiration on Andacos. I might have a spell for this, hold on. Alright, completely forgot I have guidance. Yes, you can guide it yourself. I'll just put bardic inspiration on myself. And Andacos can also use it. Yep. Okay. Would yeah. Feather I I Fall... Hmm? What? I don't uh, have the spell uh, prepared. Oh. 20. Okay. Uh, athletic. I'm just gonna put constant guidance on myself. <laughs> okay. Heaven. So Kidding. Good. No. I'm not strong. I'm sorry. <laughs> and the codes. Oh God. It's <laughs> even worse. You 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 managed to pull him closer, but he also swings downwards a little more as well. <laughs> oh no. By the Pythagorean theorem, I think. <laughs> I think should be Can fine, I just put right? the broom under him? Can I just put like so that he doesn't fall any further? But you need to fly the, the broom. broom. Oh no, I can command Wait, can you it. Command oh okay. Then then yeah. yeah, you can do that. Okay. I'll just put the broom under him so he doesn't fall any further. And okay. we just keep pulling. <laughs> yeah, and, and then you pull him back over over to here. Okay, nice. nice. Cool. Now we just gotta sit. I don't know if it's good to put him with the Banshee. Uh, the Banshee's frozen in time, right? Yeah, but when everyone's unfrozen in time, what happens? I don't know. But I think we're fine. Let's go free Zabilna. I'm just gonna leave him here? Okay. <laughs> no, yeah, he's, he's out of danger, isn't he? I think. <laughs> he's, he's out of danger, and then once the bench. <laughs> once, once he's I don't know if it's friendly. Does, does it look friendly? Would you take I mean, We can drag him down the stairs. Yeah. <laughs> That's true, yeah. Let's drag just him, tumble down, him down the stairs. Yeah, you hear, yeah. You hear his armor going. Kum, 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 kum. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. We go down the stairs. Okay. And once we're there. Oh, where's Sainaris? Uh oh right, I forgot to 
I forgot to tele teleport your tokens. Help her right back. Uh, let's just take all of you. Wait. Okay, nice. Uh, where's the Endercoast token? Do we know this guy's name? Didn't we ask Thinnings who the rest of Valor's call and no, the league the are? The thing is, we don't know who's who. We didn't ask what they look like. Yeah, we don't We don't ask what they look like, but like, yeah, um, that should be fine. I don't think Thinnings knows their names. Just that they're Valor's call. Oh. Okay. Wait. Really? Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure. I think I'm, I have their names here. I'm flipping through. I have their names here. Oh, Kalec I remember the names. Uh, oh, Ward. No, those those are the um, League. League of Malevolence. Oh, League. League of Legends. Oh, yeah. <laughs> not sponsored. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, why is it? Why is it always flipping over to that? Okay, so what do you want to do? What do you want to say? Okay, we just are we just this gonna put all of the horns on her and then say uh, Natasha? Oh, yeah, <laughs> we just do it all at once. That's definitely yeah, all at once. safe. <laughs> <laughs> sure, four fireballs uh, farther distance. <laughs> I'll do it. I'll do it. You, uh, you put all the okay. horns, uh, which, which are the uh, are all the horns again? Uh, <clears throat> so there's one from uh, a coal fire, one from a darkling store, one from the trauma horse, one from the unicorn costume, and maybe one from Skavata's house. I don't know. Yes. Yes. Just all of them at once. I'm gonna need farther distance. <laughs> uh, repeat that again. Oh, uh, one from the coal fire. Yeah. From the. the Yep. Yeah, the cauldron. The one from the, one the, from the Darkling store. Yes. Okay. One from the Trauma Horse carousel. Yeah. One from the Unicorn costume. And, and one from possibly Skabata's maybe one house. from Skabata's house. Assuming that's not the Trauma Horse one. Okay. Yeah. Uh, cool, 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 cool. Uh, and you say, what? What do you say when you touch her with those four unicorn horns? Yes. Natasha? Natasha? Okay. Roll me your D20. How many D20s are we rolling? <laughs> yeah, one. roll 4 D20. You could, you could okay. roll one and then I see what happens, or you could roll 4 D20 and then individually. Okay. Oh boy. Cool. 17, a... 28, and 13. 17. So, um... So, Andy, you feel extremely nauseous. Give me a constitution saving throw. Oh, against God. your own spell, C uh, spell save DC. Okay. Con save. Constitution saving throw. Uh, no. You failed. No. I failed. Yeah, so on your next action, you're going to throw up, which is okay. not uh, yet. <laughs> not yet. Imagine, imagine Zabilna just comes out Wakes of her time. <laughs> and then I start She's... talking. <laughs> Uh, you barf on, her. on top of that, on top of that, a fireball explodes with you at the center, oh. and each creature oh, within God. twenty feet of you must make a dexterity saving throw. Obviously, the people oh, frozen in time God. fails, and so does the cauldron. Um, oh no! Oh, uh, the cauldron. I hope it lasts. Five d six fire damage on a failed save, or half as much on a successful one. So. Uh, People within twenty feet. Uh, dexterity save. Oh. Okay. Am, am dexterity I saving. Do I do that? Uh, I I don't think you can avoid it. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> what is the uh, DC? Uh, and the closest spell save. DC? Yes. Yes. Oh. Okay. I hope the cauldron survives just a magic item. <laughs> I don't think it's gonna I'm get afraid. destroyed that easily. My spell D is 17. Oh, I, I don't make it. Oh, you don't? Hmm. 21 damage. I should be fine. Oh, and I have resistance, right? So that's... Save. 10? 
Yeah, that's 10 damage. Nice. Give me a moment. Where is and the coast deck save? <laughs> I can't. I can't deck save. I I take the hit. Oh, right. Yeah. Uh, where is so my... you just barf and then there's a fireball also. <laughs> no, no, the, the, the explosion of the fireball is what's causing your nausea for the barf. Oh. This is so bad. Jeez. Um, it's like a fart ball. That's why you're nauseated. I don't like this. I'm turning away. <laughs> <laughs> No, on the on the bright side, at least you guys moved away all those pixels. <laughs> oh yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's the good thing. Yes, yeah, so I told y'all. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure Zabilna and whoever this is have a lot of HP. I hope. I hope. Yeah. One of them's wearing armor. Yeah, they'll be fine. Uh, just that it, it's it's just the fact that they both failed the the deck deck save because they can't. Move. Yeah, they can't move. <laughs> Where is the cauldron stats? Ah, there you go. Control F. On a book. Okay, I need. I need to. Actually, does it have cauldron as an actor? It doesn't, right? Okay, Maybe I'm... not. I'm just gonna write down somewhere the cauldron HP. Okay. Just has a thousand HP. Oh, okay. Never mind. Okay, anyway. Is there anything? Sorry. Hmm? Yes. Uh, oh, right. There's still two more to go. Um. Yes. There's still two more. <laughs> uh, that was an. That was an eight and and something, right? Uh oh, eight an and, eight and uh, thirteen. Yes. Uh. Eight, eight, eight. <laughs> Why? I'll skip to the Jeez. 13 first. Oh, okay. Oh, the 13 also works. Okay, so so the last two unicorn horns don't have mm -hmm. wild magic stuff happening. The last two unicorn horns actually work. So basically, okay. so, so Zibona moves. <laughs> no. Zibona. <laughs> Zidona wakes up and immediately there's an explosion blasting it right in her face. <laughs> and vomit. And then and right vomit. after and the phone vomits right at her feet. <laughs> Projectile vomiting your own face. Oh no. <laughs> I mean, she probably knows pressure digitation, so. We're yeah, so she's sorry. fine. But the fireball. <laughs> Ow. I'm okay. I think. <laughs> um. No. <laughs> hello. Zibilna. Um, right. So once once more able to move, Zibilna lurches forward a step and quickly regains her balance only to, to have it. You, 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 you hear her say, Damn! Too late and immediately a fireball blasts in her face and and and, and she's confused for a minute. <laughs> she, she she turns around at you all very aggressively. And then and then she she brushes the, the, the explosion off and goes Have we met? What is the meaning of this? <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm, so... I'm very sorry I'm to intrude. I'm sorry. But these yeah. unicorn horns. But try our best. Uh, We're trying to free we you. are. She she looks at the unicorn horns and then at first there's also this look of confusion that everyone has and then and then you see that 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 expression on her face that's like, oh, and she goes, I, I see. How many times have you, you know? No, don't think too much about that. Um. <laughs> Oh wait, obviously like, uh, yes. how much damage do I take again? 21. You take half. Half of... Because you're a thiefing. Yeah. Half of, half 21. of 21. Oh, so yeah. that's 10. <laughs> half of 21. <laughs> 10. It, it was, it was 10. 21 5. fire damage, but you're a thiefling, so you're, you're uh, resistant, resistant to fire damage. 
Yes. Okay. Um, does Zibelna say anything? Uh, uh, she 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 looks at you and then she goes, uh, <clears throat> thank you. I I suppose I suppose uh, the uh, reciprocity is in order. Thank you for freeing me. Uh, perhaps you could give me, uh, keep me apprised on what the situation here is, and I. I suppose I shall I shall reward you accordingly. Um, oh, do you pick up the cat? <laughs> oh, yes. And pass it to uh, <laughs> pass it to her. <laughs> oh, why the cat? Uh, oh, yes. Yeah, and she's, I oh, believe you're Scarlet familiar with this Mane. cat. What a pleasure it is to see you again. I'm hiding behind Sainers. <laughs> oh no. What a pleasure to see you again. The mother isn't here, is she? And then he goes, no, but this this whole thing has been quite the entertainment for her, I believe. Oh. Well. And then she, she, yeah, and she's like, mm, very nice. Uh, uh, do stay and have tea. Perhaps uh, we'll we'll find some of that uh, fish you love. Um. <clears throat> uh, and then is there anything else you want to say? Um. Hmm. Oh. Um. I just wanted to tell her that the I'm not sure if you know, but your advisors were planning against you. Oh, and yeah, oh the yes, legal I malevolence am well argues. aware of that. I'm well aware ah. of that. Um, uh, the legal malevolence they broke into my abode, and and um, and I do believe that uh, my stepsisters were my adoptive sisters were very much involved in the coup. That's exactly what's going on here. And she waved towards her cauldron. Um, oh. So, yeah. I'm, I'm very much aware of what the situation up to the point that the time freezing curse had happened. Uh, I'm asking more in the sense of what happened while I was unavailable. Well, oh. your adoptive sister's took over the rest of Prismir. And they, um, Sabatha especially enslaved a lot of children. Oh, the audacity of it. And, and you can see her teething with the rage when, when, when you mention uh, what she did with children. Oh. Um, we killed Bavlorna. <laughs> you can see the staff. <laughs> yeah. Is that a good areas. thing? I don't know. <laughs> It's uh, I thought you tied it to your broom. Oh, oh yeah, it's with my broom. Never mind. Are, are you going to pass her the staff? Uh yes, I will pass her on the staff. Uh, and she and she sees it. Mm, very nice. And then she tosses it into the cauldron, which just immediately <laughs> melts down the staff. Oh, oh that's the end. Thank you. Oh, damn. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I I feel kind of scared of Sibyl now. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Extremely strong and comfortable in her presence. <laughs> while 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 the stuff is being melted down in the cauldron, right? You can hear ever so faintly like an ethereal shriek that sounds like um Bovlona screaming in pain. Nice. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> nice. Okay. Um what else happened? Uh well your other sisters are alive. I'm not sure if you wanted them this. At least one of them's here. <laughs> yes. Oh. Yeah. Oh, I will deal with her, I suppose. But um my my primary concern is restoring the state of my castle as well as the entire domain. My sister yes. is well, their coven is essentially broken, so they're they're really of very little little concern to me right now. If you want to deal with them, you can, I suppose. If hmm. not, uh, I could just uh, grant every one of you your wish. Oh. oh. What's your wish? Oh. I don't know what I my wish is. I did not think this far ahead. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I mean, technically I've got, got my lost item back. Really. Yeah. yeah. Yes, we all have our lost items. And you got um, your patron back, eh? Yeah. yeah. I'm assuming and the course has been buffed now. <laughs> you vomited oh, yeah. on your page. <laughs> Am I buffed now? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? what? You vomited buff. out all of your weakness. <laughs> <laughs> yes. 
Actually, yeah, you 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 feel magically buff again. You're nice. <laughs> magical Barbados. <laughs> I'm glad you're back. What was the original reason we were here again? Right. We uh, wanted to help Andacos. No, original, original. It was Kettle Steam. Oh, oh I mean. Yes. Okay. Um, oh, the witch light people. The witch light. So, yeah, the wait, witch light. Yes. Hang on, there's there's more. Uh, okay, so 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 she, um, she she she's willing to send you all home if you want. Uh, but but also because the the her cauldron is currently still intact, she she's she's offering to cast a free wish spell, one free wish oh. spell. So. Oh, okay. not one wish oh. for each of us. Yeah, my bad. One yeah, one one free wish. Oh. Oh. A boom one. <laughs> No, yeah. I mean, is it possible no. to fix uh, all of Prismere? <laughs> I'm pretty sure she can fix all of Prismere on her own. She she also yeah she can she can fix all of Pris Prismere on her own, but it will take quite a bit of time. Um, Wait, so the League of Malevolence have to disband for the Witch Light Carnival to not be like doing the sus um, stealing things from people no they just need to know that zibona is back in power and she will very quickly get that communicated to them okay uh, okay then no worries uh yeah so so she also notices that 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 you all and, and she she kind she gradually kind of recognizes um and the course as the time flows back into him um mm -hmm. and as her power flows back into him um and she notices that that uh she she acknowledges that that you have all lived your lives over over with, uh, you have all lived your lives with, with these terrible losses in the past eight or so years. It's, 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 it's unacceptable that, that these things should even happen to you. Um, I can, I can also, um, I can also you send you back to your home plane as the children you once were so that you can live your lives over without having to suffer the terrible losses that brought you here to Prismere in the first place. Oh. Does that um. mean we won't ever meet each other? No, you... you... you don't know for sure. Oh. Oh. I'd rather, I'd rather stay as chance. I am now. I'll stay as yeah. I am. Yes, yeah. I'd rather meet those here, yeah, and not have her back in your... Um, I don't want to. Uh, I'm sorry, but I don't want to go back there. She she listens she listens to to that that comment and then she looks at, at Scarlet Main and Scarlet Main is like he he looks he just gives her a little shrug and 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 she goes, I can make sure that you are all friends with each other. Hmm. I don't want to go back. <laughs> but my levels. <laughs> My levels. <laughs> my, level? my sorcerer <laughs> levels. <laughs> I'm strong. When yes. am I ever gonna get all of these pretty trinkets in my inventory? <laughs> <laughs> I no, think... I, I'm. I'm good. Mm. Yeah, we're fine. We like okay. us as we are. Okay. Though, um, my question is, um, the Witchlight Carnival has this monarch ceremony thing. Does that? Oh, we've never used to do it. <laughs> anything. Well, does that have any implications here in Prismere? Well, I suppose it does involve everyone addressing you, um, young monarch, as uh, your highness. <laughs> she she smiles over to to Osiria, and I suppose oh. to some extent. Oh. Um, there is absolutely it, it simply is unreasonable that uh that one should enslave royalty that that's simply unacceptable i don't oh. i don't think uh you you have my word that you will not return to uh my mother as as my adoptive mother as a slave if you do wish to return to her i suspect i suspect there might be reward in place for you Oh? Hmm? I don't know. Scarlet Mane, could you uh, uh, make sure that happens? And Scarlet Mane just goes, I'll try my best. Um, perhaps, I, I I think the fact that she's not here yet is already a testament to, the, to, to her agreeing with the idea. 
Can that reward hmm. be freedom? Yeah, <laughs> I think you've already been rewarded freedom. Permanent freedom. Um. Uh. She. She. she, she yeah. She. She goes. Yes, you do have the freedom of choice to return to her if you wish. If you return to her, then she could she she could potentially treat you like one of her own. The you way she is. Yeah, I could say there is. <laughs> oh. Or perhaps you could. Uh, we could serve you. I. You seem benevolent enough. And you might have use for a multiversal, a planar traveler like myself in your Did court. You That's kind of rude, man. <laughs> what? What? Oh, the other Nani. way around. <laughs> no, she's gonna. What do you mean? Okay. Yes. Uh, and then she goes, This does sound like a great idea. Um, I will take it into consideration. Okay. As for our wishes. Do we have any wish? One wish, yeah. One wish each, or like... No, one wish, sorry. Wish oh. she, she literally has one casting of wish per day, so... Oh, okay. Perfect. She can just have a long rest. <laughs> <laughs> she just cast... <laughs> um. Barbados. Oh, Barbados? That's her wish? Ooh. We just bring back the rap god. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> oh. Um... I, I missed them. <laughs> I'm sure we can just dispel the mask that we have. I think. Oh, do you think like Ziv does uh, Zivil does she know like how to how to, fix how to get rid yeah. of the thing without yeah. having to use a wish spell? Yes. Uh, she. Do you take it or ask? Yes. Yes. Yeah, she looks like it. Oh, it's a simple dispelling spell. You can simply oh. dispel the magic and it'll be gone. Oh, okay. Nice. Thank you. Um, mm. What wish do you guys want? We can always be super chaotic and be like, I wish for my own domain. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> do you guys want to rule over something? I mean, we could. We share domain. I do, I do, <laughs> not really. Wanna, I do, I do <laughs> want a, like, a little space for us. Oh, <laughs> uh, speaking of domains, that is so um, cool domain. <laughs> Sir Talavar came as, as well, and he was an emissary of the Sealy Court, specifically Titania, I think. And they would want you, Zubilna, to join their ranks. Oh, not this little politics again. Leave that to me when I have to deal with it. Oh. Oh, okay. I will take note. Maybe... Hmm. Honestly, I just want a very powerful magic item, but I don't know what you guys want. <laughs> <laughs> you can one. have it. Boom I just need one. to get home. Oh, wait. Does my... Will my age stay like this when I get, get back to the human... We have no idea. Realm? I think so. Will we only a few... each other again? It's only been a few days, right? We don't know. <laughs> yeah, you don't I mean, know. Since okay. the thing started. <clears throat> yeah. It's been a while. It'll be awkward to go home and like, uh, everyone I know is dead, you know? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but there is there is the, the, the thing where, where um, Elliot has the issue where his parents don't recognize him, right? Oh? So, oh, right, because... Hmm. I got lost in the Feywild as a child, so... Oh, right. They lost. Yeah, so so if what Elliot is... wants to be young again, there's, there's, there, there is that option to, to be young again that his parents don't don't lose recognition of their child and, and wonder where the child has gone. Oh. I mean, oh. I, can, I can live without it. Okay. <laughs> I have you friends You don't like your now. parents, right? <laughs> you have friends. <laughs> you don't need parents. <laughs> <laughs> um okay oh also there's a fomorian in your banquet hall eating a cake i'm not <laughs> sure if you know that <laughs> you, you, oh, see yeah, a face, and... you, you, you see a face turns fear then angry again and then <laughs> i'll have to deal with that very soon then 
It's my birthday cake. Your oh. owl. Your owl is just Happy oh. birthday. Um. Oh, yes. Oh. An, an owl, owl is also you. chasing a Jabberwock. <laughs> my jab. Oh, I suppose it had to happen. I'll deal with them. You know what? And then she waves her hand. Yeah. And, and, and you feel like a very strong ripple of magic pass through. Oh. And uh, that loud screeching and, and wailing and crashing about that's happening outside just stops. Si it's oh. just absolute silence outside. Damn. Mm. She's OP. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Uh, so someone wants the Kaboom wand? We can totally that go with that wish. <laughs> <laughs> we can go with that wish. Either a kaboom wand or like the the staff of the archmage or something like that. What's that? <laughs> it's a very powerful magic item. <laughs> I don't know what that is. I don't know if Senaris would know what that is, but I want this. <laughs> <laughs> the most powerful magic item you can give me. <laughs> Y'all don't want your own domain. <laughs> No, I don't want to rule over anything. I'm fine, like... You, you don't necessarily rule over it, it's just like, you know... It's yours. a domain. <laughs> a pocket dimension for us. You just get its benefits and everything. Oh, that's true. You're like a domain shareholder. <laughs> oh, yeah, just shareholder. <laughs> I mean, it's just nice having this place to hang out, right? Yeah. 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 It doesn't have to be a big domain. Oh, it's like the spider. Remember the giant spider? Oh yeah, the spider. Well, we, we never got gone back there. To that. Yeah, we, we can go about there. About them. After saving Zabilna, we just go back. <laughs> can we ask Zabilna who the spider is? <laughs> um. You, wait, you ask Zabilna about the spider? Yeah, yes. it's a little spider deal. Uh, I don't know whether to be sus of it or not. She she winces and then and then you see her feeling around and then she. Well, uh, I I believe what's happened is that someone has taken up residence on my property, um, without knowing that it's actually someone else's property. Oh, oh. they need to be oh. taxed. <laughs> and and it, yeah, did. For... it did it did happen <laughs> within the past few years, so of course it happened without my knowledge. Oh, oh. I see. Um, I feel like okay. land is a pretty good thing to wish for. <laughs> land, yeah. you can just get land. You don't have to wish for it. We have money. I think. Um, <laughs> look at my empty wallet. <laughs> yeah, empty <laughs> wallet. You guys have you so sell much all your magic you items. Yeah. Yeah, but we didn't sell them. You can sell them when you get back. Especially oh. the sus ones. Sell all the sus ones. <laughs> sell all the sus ones. I mean, alright, I guess. Um, yeah, you'll be rich beyond your wildest dreams. Out of character, but like, can we wish for forgiveness for all the crimes we did? <laughs> oh, Wait, yeah. that's, that's really not aware. Yeah, is the villain not aware of what we've done? Yeah. <laughs> to some extent, yes. Oh, um, I guess she doesn't mind. Like, like she's kind of Ish. getting the sense back, but you can see that she's in a very good mood. Ah. Okay. I'm sorry. It's good. <laughs> what do we wish for? Do you want your yeah, magic? Yeah, I, I feel like... Do you want, like, a home domain? <laughs> I feel Just like for all of us? Wish mm. is kind of the most logical and reasonable oh what it's 320 i have to I yeah have to leave. oh we need to end oh soon. no okay oh, yeah. yes okay this is the final i think session no unless you guys want to do anything else after this after, after this session yeah, yeah. What, do you guys want to do anything else oh yeah <clears throat> But yeah, if, if if you want to go with Kismet's wish, then uh, she will carve out. Uh, wait, you are you guys want to go with her wish, right? What is, what my is wish the wish again? again? Uh, uh, to own your own domain. The domain. Sure, we can have a home domain. Yeah, for um, all of us, like it's like a shared dorm thing. <laughs> shared can dorm, we get a yeah. tavern? <laughs> can we get a tavern? Oh yeah, so I'll you can yeah, Let's just let's just be patrons of that one tavern. Well, in. 
the, 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 the oh, you mean the one. inn at the end of the, of the road? Road? Is that yeah, what it is? One. I mean, we did like promise to like support them and everything. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Yeah, and and then she goes, mm, of course. Uh, uh, you can even have it as your own domain. And then she 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 pulls apart the fabric of 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 magic and Reality. and and um, and and begins casting the wish spell and 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 the. You don't immediately see or feel the effects of it, but but, um, uh, and 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 she goes. You now have ownership of the tavern, um, and as part of its own uh fey domain, uh your your own fey domain, um, you, the the few of you will have uh some magical control over it. It's simple things like anything that could come to mind potentially could actually be possible in your own little tavern. Oh. That's so cozy. <laughs> yes. Okay. Um Yay. I I really have to go now, so I'll leave for okay. Take care. Yes. Okay. Bye. Bye. Okay. And okay. I suppose that's the end of the story. No. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> we didn't get to look end, at yeah. the rest of the castle. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm so sorry. We skipped over. I feel like Kellogg and the rest are like, what the heck is happening? <laughs> Especially since the villain is gonna show up right in his face. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh boy. Slash I mean, we could do the. Do. What was that? <laughs> Domain of Delight? Of. What's that? Was that? The, the spider? Is that yeah. the one? But the spider one it actually wasn't a lot. Um, it was... Oh, like it was, a one-shot kind of thing? Actually, I didn't put in much for it. It, it was it was just kind of a, a teaser for, like, um, if you want to create your own domain, you can. And also, the other thing inside there is that there is... Um, there is a... <clears throat> There's a little girl that's, that's there. Um, she got lost. Uh, mm -hmm. she, she had a lost item. Her name is Mega Max. Mega Max? Yeah. Uh, totally unrelated to uh, a, a fictional character called Megumin. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. oh. Okay. We should have gone there. <laughs> we could have no. gone there now. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, yeah, um, we could. And yeah, and her chilling. last item was just her ability to cast uh, ex explosion. <laughs> oh no! He <laughs> just has the kaboom one. Your missing item is the kaboom one. You're gonna steal no. it from a little girl, huh? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Sinaris knows no moral bounds. Ah, <laughs> it's over. It's not over yet. I refuse. We need an epilogue. <laughs> we need, a, we need epilogue. to just see Zabilna punching everyone in the face. <laughs> <laughs> just go around looking at her. Like, get out of my house! <laughs> <laughs> follow her dealing with people. Yes. Aww. Aww. I'm sad. I'm sad now too. So when's the next session? I am specifically <laughs> What's the next campaign? Here. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh, right. No. We can do like recap stuff like an epilogue. Just like talk about the session. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. We could. Oh yeah, that's true. Yeah. Then you can yeah. ask questions, whatever questions that's left that, that um... Has not been answered. <clears throat> yeah, that's not been yes. answered. That, so so you, you basically have one week to con condense all the questions that you've had across the <laughs> game and and yeah mm. and and i will answer them to the best of my knowledge next stream which would be the last for well beyond the wish like i guess or oh. or, or or we play what we play the entire campaign again <laughs> what? From the start, and we explore every single nook and cranny <laughs> no <laughs> every nook and cranny um Hmm. I wonder if Mr. Witch and Mr. Light will still take us back as Witch Light Hands. I don't think so, though. Ooh. Do you still want to work there? Considering, you know, their work ethic and safety. Yeah. 
I'd rather Maybe not. Maybe should have wished for like health and safety <laughs> for the <laughs> carnival. Maybe no, we can just talk to them about it. They're cutting costs, man. Just you for know, safety. You know, you could just like mm -hmm. we got a tavern. We can just like make it a business. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we could. We're just all tavern. tavern and we're all just the barkeep. The incredibly yeah. strong barkeeps that you shouldn't mess with. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I actually saw this like TikTok or something about say they're saying like how like the barkeeps are actually like retired adventurers. Yeah, retired stuff. adventurers. Yeah, so they're all like super super OP actually, but they're just taking care of the tavern. That's yeah. us now. So we are dead. Yeah, we are dead. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, and then and then probably somewhere along the way while you're running your tavern, you'll 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 have these these new level one or level five uh uh, uh adventurers right. come in and then and then and then they're they're the murder hobo, hobo kinds, which is like uh oh, I, no. I wanna oh. I wanna threaten the, the I wanna threaten the barkeep so that they they they, they don't charge me for the, the rooms and the meals. <laughs> <laughs> and you're like oh you sweet summer child <laughs> oh no. Oh, oh Skabatha's here. Hello, Skabatha. What? Where? Wait, where are you? Exp are you exploring? Yes. <laughs> take me with you. That's so rude. <laughs> Don't you be I'm just seeing everything. Well, wait, everything I can because there are so many locked places. I went to the left. I think I just heard my mom. My mom right. called for oh. me. Yeah, I, I think oh, I, I think we heard her also. Oh. I you you heard her even. too. God, she's loud. Okay, yeah, I, can I, hear I better her go. Okay. I better go. Okay. So, bye bye. So yeah, we'll <laughs> bye. 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 I'll see you next time. Uh, yes. he, he be no he be no no. I I don't I don't mean it as as in as in as in. As in, it, I, I I don't mean it as, as in I'm gonna change it because because of you. It's 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 you're you're not the only one that's told me that they entered the stream and then they have no idea what's going on. And also I I yeah. I've entered my friends' streams and I also don't know what's going on. It's 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 <laughs> I, I the the thing that I find entertaining for D and D streams is just that when at that moment people do something that's absolutely chaotic, and then yes. <laughs> and then it's it's hilarious. I like how we just. <laughs> muscled our way through the information from Scarlamane. That's <laughs> Natasha's name. <laughs> I didn't think that would work honestly. There's like there's like like little hints and teasers all over the, the palace that, that hints at her name being Natasha. Oh I was wondering if there was a library around here. There probably is. Considering she's a what is she, a wizard? <laughs> Um, she oh. is currently an archfake. Um, oh. Uh, but in in her past, she was uh, an arch mage. Mage. Oh, okay. Man, it's very hard to get into D and D in the middle of a stream. I don't. Hmm. Would you ever stream a D and D campaign again? Opposite day? I think I think probably not because it's it's a bit it's a bit too restrictive I think and and it's also mm. it's also like that um uh like streaming a D&D campaign is 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 content wise I think it's not very very good streaming content yeah but like like a one shot maybe because because it's 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 smaller and bite sized and easier to catch that's uh, true. It, yeah, a whole campaign would be would be like, oh wow, there's 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 what yes. more than thirty five episodes to catch <laughs> if you want to. Yeah. <clears throat> um, That's true. But like, I could I could run a D and D game off off stream, possibly. Mm -hmm. Possibly, yeah. <laughs> Maybe a homebrew one. I don't know. But also, also mm -hmm. it's it's so much work. So. <laughs> yeah, it is a lot of work. Ismet, where are you going? Exploring. Okay. Ah, oh, man. I wonder what the rest the of wall. this place had. Oh, it is the wall. It's so sad. We just exploring now. Oh, what's this? <laughs> hmm? what's yeah, what? this this is like if you if you entered the 
the place through the, the normal route. Ah. Uh, what is this? A chariot? Yeah, it's a glass chariot. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Ooh. Uh. Glass slippers. I should I should end the stream. Yes, uh, I should end. I also yeah. have dishes to do. But yeah, let's just immediately throw everyone into this room that everyone sees. The, the two of you see. But yeah. Yes. Um, who to raid? Who to raid? Hmm. <laughs> Who's streaming right now? Uh. Oh. Thanks for the follow, Hebe. <laughs> he didn't follow. <laughs> uh, so anyway, <laughs> as long Damn. as we eventually get there. <laughs> I don't see anyone on my end that's streaming. I've been watching our oh. wolf lately, but but uh, I don't think he's he's the kind of content that everyone would be into. Uh, oh, vegan pints. Oh. Uh, Bloody D is very chaotic if you're into... Oh, and, and Vegan Pint is a very, very cute game. Oh. Mm. So, so yeah, uh, we could we could rate uh, Bloody D. Sure. It looks hella cute, yes. Also, also, Rice Bits was... I think Rice Bits was streaming Vegan Pint for a bit. And, and <laughs> I wanted to know the entire story. It... <laughs> you can find this is is one of those games that there's like um there's multiple 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 possible endings so you just keep mm -hmm. playing it over and over and over again until you find the the true ending oh, oh. i see that seemed like I think a cool I game fell into the back rooms what what did you do <laughs> um there's undercoats with the three hags here <laughs> wait what score are you i don't know it says court of storms throne room Oh, did you go to like the oh. middle part? Where <laughs> Skabata <laughs> uh, was? Um, yes. Let me just like quickly read it. Like three hacks, including. Oh. That's the raid message if you have yeah. a sub, and there's the raid and message then... if you don't have a sub. <laughs> Let's go raid D. Uh, send, her, send her more chaos than she is already full of. Um, and then yes. and then we will we will uh come back again for a QA session next week. Yes. Okay. Bye. Yes, yes. Bye.